Welcome, my lovely dears, to another dashing and daring payday game with our gang. It's it's your girls and boys. It's Amiri, it's Red, it's Fergus, it's Ross, it's Ryan Rybread Remington. All at him again. You know them. You know them well. How could you possibly ever forget? <laughs> it's your boy, Ryan Rybread Remington. <laughs> oh, goodness. And when we last left off, you guys did some side jobs. Yeah, we got a big freak fight. fight. Freak fight. Freak, yeah. Release the freaks! It was very important. And you succeeded. Even when we... the freaks were released. Yes, we we killed the horrible uh, ogre peed. Yeah, the, there certainly were some freaks, and we fought them. The ogre peed was mighty. I killed two of them. Ogre peed was spooky. <sighs> I don't know if I'd say spooky, more like disgusting. He was yeah, hideous. I like the idea well, like, that I said that horrible at the, for at the, a reason. Yeah, at the at the <laughs> at the start of a fucking round of combat, it begins a fart and it ends at the end of a round of combat. I, I <laughs> Ryan Rybred Remington spent quite a while getting the stink off of him and had to boil his rapier. Yep. Goodness me. All right. Rub, rub my bits together. We pick up now with your next job, essentially. You've had your time. You've got a meeting to attend to. Uh, and it's uh, a meeting in a nice park in the middle of the day. Mm-hmm. Uh, you've been given details by your bro. Okay. I'm going to grab a hot dog on the way. If it's a nice park, there's going to be a hot dog stand. Mm-hmm. Uh, let me double check. Where is it? The old Holisha map. It is a park in Temple Ward. Okay. Daddy. There. Nothing ever happens bad in Temple Ward. I'll pay extra for the one that's mostly not rat. Aside from, like, the Haunted Abbey in Temple Ward. That's fine, you just don't go in it. Yeah. No Nothing one goes in it. That's why it, it stayed haunted. I mean, it's really, it's it's only dangerous if you go in there, and it keeps killing people who are dumb, so honestly it helps solve the homeless problem for this town. They think it's great. <laughs> The broken, you know abbey is a heritage. You, it's, it, the, the broken abbey is a heritage site by this point, so, you know, they couldn't knock it down even if they wanted to. Ugh, the paperwork you have to file. Mm. Oh well. Okay. So, you're meeting at the park. Let me check the map over here. Yeah. You're able to take Juniper on a lovely stroll down Cobble Streets. Yay. Clip, clop, clip, clop, clip, clop. And you can see that it is, as you approach, a nice daytime park. Great big flowery rose bushes, a trickling fountain. You can see some noble lady reading a uh, little, like, Times Letter Gazette thing. It's pretty upper class. There is, yes, as you can see, the broker. She is sat on a bench currently, uh, similarly reading one of these gazettes. You can see across, like, the other side of the park is just a building, like a little marquee building where they sell stuff like that. Yep, that's why we'll sit over there on the bench next to her. 
the broker looks up and across at you and smiles. Hello there. Did you uh, get the plaque? Yes, we had moderate success in our endeavors. Hmm. Only moderate success? Complete success. Is well, what she means. <laughs> okay. I was concerned there for a moment. She's being modest. I see, I see. It's dangerous to try and keep up with your antics while you're in the middle of them, you know? It's not like I have spies checking for your every movement. That's a noble girl kind of game, and I certainly don't have that kind of money. Well, I do have a certain kind of money. And speaking of, uh, she reaches underneath the bench and pulls out what looks like a little lunch rucksack. Uh, however, she like kicks the lip of the rucksack open so that you can see into it so that there are a whole bunch of gold bars. Oh my god. Where'd Northy go? Oh, well, sorry. Uh, where'd Slim go? <laughs> I'm Slim! No, he's just <laughs> gone stealthy. Yeah, I have your money, and I suppose I have your next destination. Of course. Unfortunately, it appears to have been vanished from where it originally was. Some noble person picked it up, I believe, because the excuse they used was renovating the piece because it had gotten uh, uh, tarnished, I suppose. It is a bronze plaque, but the it doesn't seem like a coincidence. So part of me is wondering, and she slips the lid of the bag closed again and slides it back onto her bench. Have you all decided to fuck me? No. Uh, and that depends. Literally or metaphorically? Metaphorically. Then I'm... no. Okay. Yes, I don't... I try not to fuck criminals. If there's a way of coming back to you in a bad way. I dare say that you're as much a criminal as any of us. Indeed. And should someone tell me to go fuck myself, I'll explain very cleanly that that is a <laughs> thing that I don't agree with. And yeah, show Regardless. an insight on you guys. You can have advantage. I am, I'm clearly not lying. Yeah, she looks you over in France. All right. Well, then, were you spotted by anyone who might know what's going on here? We weren't spotted by anyone no. at all. At least on the job we did for you. On the job we did for you, there is no one to spot us at all. Stop. Very well. Show me the plaque, then. Sure, and I'll reach up from under me and under my cloak and show it to her. I had it in a lead line box. Oh. oh, look at that. Well, it's been a yeah. few days, so like I could just easily like have it underneath the cloak and everything for that. I mean, sure. Presumably in the box, box so it but I would dried. rather keep it in the box. Yeah, that too. Yeah. 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 And, okay. uh, Slim was our thing keeper. I see. Well, thank you very much. And yeah, she'll slide the bag back out again. Yeah, enjoy. My thanks. She looks out and forward. I know where it was last located. Which means you're going to have to go and, well, find it, I suppose. Oh, no. If this is the, uh, uh, if this is the one for this one where we have to do an investigation, my next name would have been perfect for this. I'm so sad. Wait, no, no, hold on. You already got Remington. Just, you're Remington Steel, private investigator. No, you don't understand. I had been thinking about it all week. And yes, P.I. was at the end of the name. Oh, okay, that would have been perfect, regardless then. Uh, Anyways. The S. Where was it? I now it have done? the Mason plaque, and I was sending you after the Varai pack, uh, plaque. It was meant to be in a tower structure that was used, um, oh, I, I'll best to say it in the clandestine fashion, as a boudoir. Oh, oh well then. Very well. 
What a shame you could have put on all of your scantiliest clothing and snuck inside to go and find the plaque. You slip out wearing a mankini trying to hide it on your person. <laughs> Don't give me ideas now. Of course, of course. Unfortunately, as I said, it has been picked up by someone who uh, announced they wanted to clean the thing up and maintain it. A number of other artifacts were taken off of their hand with yeah, historical relevance, presumably to not arouse suspicion. It would be strange if they came from just the plaque, but a whole collection of fanciful items that are meant to be on display in your high-class sex boudoir. That's... that makes sense. She sighs and leans back in her chair. I'll give you their address. Uh, at which point? Uh, would everyone please give me a perception test? Perception. Yes, I'm already absolutely. suspiciously eyeing this other noble woman, by the way. <laughs> oh, yeah. Like, oh. very clearly. Let's see here. Ross, come on. Love it, boys. Uh, I'm going to go ahead oh, and. Oh, that's just sad when you have a bunch of You know what? Yeah. This is uh, worth you using want... an inspo on. Yeah, I can. Yeah, I can use an inspo here. Sure. <laughs> wow. Okay. Wait a Sixteen. Hold on. Let me just. Uh... No, I if sixteen doesn't it. work, I'm going to spend inspiration too. <laughs> you don't detect anything unusual. All right. With the sixteen. Hold on. Seems fine. I'm just going to throw a guidance on that. The broker will look I at keep, you strangely. I keep the three with inspiration, right? That's a 19. Mm. Yeah, the broker's looking at you funny when you begin to cast a spell. And maybe it is the fact that you're continuing to look over here at this random noble woman while you begin casting magic. Um, Amira, you hear a voice behind you go, I would stop if I were you. Do I see him? Uh, yes, you do. There appears to be a figure in an essentially like a ghillie suit stood up against the side of this tree. We've got both my red two. You can see that there is also another one uh, over here. In fact, you're pretty sure there are a lot of them. We've lots of company. The broker looks alarmed. She'll pocket the plaque and shove you the gold bag. Do you mean that alone? There's someone in the bushes. Several it's someones. Impossible. I got here first and no one came in. No, you didn't Maybe get here been first. they have been there for longer. She glances over at the noble lady who's still reading her magazine and then looks confused at the rest of you. As, yeah, the trees begin to move and speak Vietnamese. Oh, my no. god, I've never met a talking bush before. Oh Tell god, it's me. the park rangers. What does photosynthesis... What does photosynthesis feel like, my friend? Yeah, It seems no, you're no, the no. one that has fucked us, metaphorically. The broker quacks a brow. I don't know these people. I'm sure. How about you just put all of your weapons on the ground? We'll have ourselves a nice polite chat and move on our way. Don't even care that you're shuffling around a great big bag of lucre. It would be very easy to take, but we have good manners. And who's we? Do I see, like, uh, symbolizing features on them, like uh, emblems or anything? Or... Uh, no, they are all wearing it, a uniform, it but it is an unemblemed uniform. It's, you know, typical ranger garb and, like, ghillie cloaks. Okay. Has a noble looked up at all these guys uh, arriving and speaking up? No, no, she has not. Hmm. What are you, some kind of arboreal honor guard? In a manner of speaking, it could well be. An honor guard, certainly. Now then, those weapons. Figure sits down his trident. Look to the rest of you. You have until the count I'm, of five. I'm going to... 
I'm gonna flick uh oh, nice. my oh, rapier nice. in uh into the cobblestone and set my feet atop it. I'm just gonna you know what? Yeah, Amriel Amriel will put Did her I... staff down. She's still got her daggers hidden on her, but you know, hidden operative. Yeah. I want to try and yeah, slide my hand like my short sword just so they can't see it. That's a good. That's a question, isn't it? I mean, oh, I fine. never just said it. Up to you. I mean, we could probably yeah. hit these losers. Yeah, I'll just put my weapons on the ground. I guess. I never. Yeah, I never said anything about putting down the holdout weapons. But I will yeah. lean back and uh, uh, pull out a filigree flask. Yeah, I'll also rat a tat tat on the ground. Oh no. Loaded, it goes off. It shoots someone in the leg. Uh, <laughs> Bang! Why do you keep <laughs> leaving that thing loaded? <laughs> Doesn't come with a safety. It's a crossbow. All right. Look at you. How very clever. Okay. That will be all the lady will be speaking with you now. At which point the lady will put her little pamphlet away gets up and begins to saunter on over. She is a tall, plush, and certainly noble lady. Well, make it up. Uh, Ross, you're stared at as she approaches, and she gestures for you to back the fuck up. Winter wasn't paying attention. Damn we start the combat round now. Oh, oh, sorry. I'm just gonna move him. <laughs> I'm not sure if I'm sad or glad that I didn't do what I had initially considered when we got here, which was just throwing sleep on this random noble lady. <laughs> <laughs> You're like, no, he's dropping mm. for you, bitch. <laughs> yes, the pretty lady will adjust herself. And you can all make history checks to see if you recognize her. Sure. Okay. Sure. Why not? Still good at history, oh. guys. Uh, history. No. Uh, I'll make one for the broker as well. No idea. Now then. It is a pleasure to meet you. You may call me Alba. I happen to have something that you would all be very interested in, I'm sure. Oh. Please, Indeed. go on. My associates picked it up just last night from a lovely little building where people get their sordid pleasures out of the way. Oh my All god, right. the MacGuffin has come to us. And what do you want for it? Well, you see, that's a very, very interesting thing. Did you know that you have... Oh, goodness, how to put it. Your little payment there is being made in, as you might guess by the amount, stolen funds, yes? No, it's come across it was from the church. How disappointing. I assumed it was stolen from the church. Mm. Same difference. She looks at the broker. You, naughty young girl, stole mason money to pay these rogues to steal from a mason house. Oh, naughty God. little dubber dipper, aren't you? Broker firmly sets her lips closed. Oh, don't be so terrified. I don't especially care about that. I just think, why should the masons lose all of their money? When there are other targets out there, such as a target that might happen to own a plaque that we have, the Varys. It probably would have been too easy for you to acquire this thing. It wouldn't do them nearly enough damage. I'm waiting for the agreement. So... Was, you know, it wasn't exactly rhetorical. So oh, I had assumed it was mostly rhetorical. Further fuck over the Masons? Who gives a shit about um, fucking who? What do you want from us? I want you to steal some Varai money. You can keep all of your Mason cash if you want. 
And we're going to give this money to you, presumably. Oh, no, no, you can keep it. It's a lot of money. It's basically impossible to move. But you're just an anarchist. Fuck the noble houses. No, she just wants her rivals fucked over. Yes, yes. Obviously, I would appreciate some of the money, but in this certain situation, I cannot make use of it. So you can take it, sell it, use it, and whatever way you want to use, I don't know, 20,000 gold. I don't care. What I care about is that the Varai don't have it. Fair okay. enough. End of the plank. It sounds simple enough, but where exactly do you expect us to get that yeah. load of money from? It's not like they'll just have that lying about. Of course they have that lying about. There are establishments built in this city exclusively so that money can lie about in it. <laughs> you want us to go straight to a vault? Yes, look at you. You may be stupid enough to steal from nobles once, but you're smart enough to know where to go to steal twice, I suppose. Yes, you're going to have to break into a vault. A private bank, more correctly. Mm hmm She smiles, and it's, it's a very pretty smile on a pretty lady, even if she's all looking at you like a cat who got the cream. Perfect. Wonderful. Yes, I would like to you to steal from the Verize Bank. It's here. Well, down the street from here. It's within this district. Just a little private place, merchants, marketeers, a little bit of under-the-desk money. I want you to take all of it. And I have what you need to get into the vault. Now we're talking. All right. All right. You see the place suicide lot... before. No, it's not quite as much. No, oh, of course, exactly. I mean, I wouldn't sell you for impossible job. That would be pointless. Mm. Oh, goodness. No. No, no, no. The only issue is that at night time, the entrance to this vault is quite impregnable, unless you want to go knocking the whole building over, and I can't really agree with that, it's just a bit too much damage. You have to break in, in the day, and get into the vault with my little toy. Alright then, Miss Alba. Doesn't seem like I exactly have much choice, so I guess I have to accept. And one of her men will climb out of the bushes, and you can see he's carrying a very heavy object. It looks like some kind of crate. He places it down beside her and steps back into the bushes again. This here <laughs> is a drill. I'm sure you all know how drills work, yes? Yes. Yeah. But this is a well, special this... drill. Correct. This drill punches through magical locks. It's not the fastest thing, it's a little bit loud as well, but it'll get you through a vault in no less than a minute. Maybe a minute and a half. It can be a bit temperamental. I'm sure it'll be fine if I just give it a good smack every now and again. Well, I suppose that's fine with me. Go on, then. Off you pop. I'll be Not here towards. waiting. All right, then. Uh -huh. Oh, what? Do you expect us to do this now with no prep? Yes. You can pick your weapons up oh. off the floor if you'd like to. Uh -huh. well, well. All right, certainly you can do some preparation. I'll give you until sundown. But if the sun falls and the vault locks up, you're out of luck. I'll be taking my money back out of your hides. Well, you know. She smiles thinly. 
Oh, the pretty ones are always the most dangerous, after all. Mm -hmm. Well, Broker, I don't do the stops, and you fucked us royally in the ass, so I'll be taking my cut and fucking off now. Goodbye. The Broker looks at you alarmed. I'll just leave like this. Why shouldn't I? 20,000 gold is why you shouldn't. That's a lot of money. 20,000 gold is a lot of money, yes, if I live to spend it. Well, what do you think happens if you just try and up sticks? I'd give myself pretty exactly damn good odds about of... running these losers. The broker looks nervous. Please, is there any way I can persuade you? <sighs> if you go, they're probably just going to kill me. And whoever of you doesn't get away in time. Well, you really should have thought of that before you fucked this all up. Yes, I suppose I should have thought it before there were fucking ninjas in the bushes. This is a whispered conversation between these people. Yeah. Yes. Okay. I'm mm -hmm. just gonna continue. Uh, actually, right what here between said, them. When she said you could pick up your weapons, I'm going to uh, like lift up one of my boots and uh, just uh, kick the rapier in the air and catch it. Yep. It wasn't really uh, laid on the ground after all. Of course, of course. There are a lot of eyes. What like no one flinches when you kick the blade up, but you feel the sensation of a bunch of eyes watching the rapier rise and then slide down into your uh, grasp again. I'm just going to uh, put it in my jack uh, uh, sheath. It just raise her brow at all the whispering. That and I think if you try and leave, I mean, uh, we're very much fucked if you do. Well, you should just leave too. You can fucking fly. I give you the best odds of anyone getting out of here, okay? Broke looks confused. You can fly? I'd rather keeping that trick up my sleeve in case I needed to hear, but yes. Oh, well, bully for you, I suppose. I guess I'll just have to perish. Also, I don't know if you'll notice, but... She said she'll have to take her money back. Yes, I rather suspect she works for the Masons. I suspect or that she, she is the Mason. Is herself. a Mason. Yes. No one's ever really met their matriarch. Wouldn't have thought it to be so young looking, but if that is the Mason matriarch, then I don't know if the short term escape is in the cards. I don't believe it is. Hmm. Please. You can quit this job afterwards, if that's the case, but... Surely. You're not going to just give up potentially any of you to die, be hunted by... The, maybe the Matriarch of the Masons and give up 20,000 gold. This girl can make a persuade check, I suppose. Yeah, I will assist her, because I feel we need the entire crew for this one. I mean, it's like one of the few things that she has a whopping plus four in. Does she like to just assist me in keeping Amiri around? I mean, she's still, she's the one saying it. That's true. A 23. Yeah, nice. 23, that's pretty good. Come on, 20,000 could get you an awful lot of whatever it is that you need. Like I said, uh, the right. money's not any good to me if I'm dead, but... Amy will just reach down and put a hand on the back of the girl's neck. You're young, and clearly out of your depth. I'll stick around this once just because you're cute. I... She blinks. Thank you. <laughs> uh, right, Red. We'll just look back. Uh, day's not getting any shorter. Let's go. 
You're very lucky you have us instead of someone else. Others would have just left you for dead. Yes, I am getting that suspicion. Uh, and yeah, I, uh, it, Riber, did you grab the crate or is uh, Babo trying? What? Sl Slim likes boxes. Everyone oh, okay. knows Slim, Slim likes Everyone boxes. Everyone knows that Slim likes boxes. The broker size. Look, I'll, I can try and help you case the joint, if anything. It's the least I can do. And mm. she does, Amira, before you can leave, uh, dumps the whole sack of gold bars in your arms. Oof. Oh. Oh. Before we... Uh, I got it. Before we wheel off to uh, our various wheelings and dealings, uh, with the exception of Amira, five, goals, five gold, everyone, please. I'm going to the temple. Which one? It doesn't. <laughs> she look. looks nervously uh, in the direction of the destroyed temple. Not that one. Okay. We just need some cure <laughs> scrolls. Because this will be a oh. fight. Tell you what, I can get those on a deal. How many do you need? Uh, well, then I'll flicker the uh, 5 GP Amira gave us. Yes. And then 5 GP of my own. One for each of us should be fine. Okay, well. Yeah, she'll check her pockets, and you can see that her own wallet appears to be, like, mostly silver. Pets, does Ross keep any healing spells for prepared? One for me. I uh, hang on, let's see what I... I don't... F Maybe I did? I can't remember. Well, I mean, you should have them checked on your sheet. I do. Healing word. Oh, okay. I mean, I have to go look at my sheet. Well, we have that, so that's nice. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I think uh, five cure wound scrolls would be sufficient to get us through this in the event of an emergency. Okay. I'll just mark those down for myself because Ross's DPS is probably better than mine. Mm. Can, you, can you cast healing word scrolls? Uh, or he cure wound scrolls? I can cast cure wounds, I cannot cast healing word. I can cast healing words, so yeah, so that's there, that's there, that's that. Uh, no, that was the Varai plaque. The first plaque you stole was a Mason plaque. Oh, well, Varai pack, whatever. Yeah. Same difference here. I'll tell you what, Broker. Now that your ass is in the line as deep as ours, you might as well give us your name. Or a name, other than just Broker. I'm Vera. V-I-R-A. Nice and simple. Vera Kiris. Vera. Fine. Go get those scrolls. We'll pace the place. And you tuck yourself away somewhere nice and safe, and we'll do the dangerous bit. Mm. Indeed, I, I should tell you as well. I have a family name that kind of attracts a lot of trouble and attention, if I'm honest. <laughs> Please don't tell Something me tells me Mason. the matriarch there has already figured it out, but we'll keep that secret if you'd like. No, I should probably tell you. It is in spirits. Vera in spirits. And you're all welcome to make a history test. Sure, why I'll not? I'll take one at disadvantage, because I'm not from around here. Could you say that again? What? Sorry. Vera in Spiris. Uh, I'm at least a quarter wildling. God damn it. I see you're familiar with them. I am one. Oh! <laughs> hmm. Siblings, cousins. Yes. <laughs> Vera just ponders. I. It's impossible to say the Inspirus line is a mess. All I know is that when two people who are Inspirus try to fuck, then a little bit of a warning signal goes off in the backs of their heads. <laughs> uh, tell me the truth, Scout. Did you name her Vera on purpose as a reference? It's not. No, Vera is not a reference to anything. Oh, okay. Because we're we're literally robbing a bank, and uh, Vera Keys was the NPC helping Dean Domino rob the uh, rob the casino 
it, uh, we're, you know, a crime bank. We're helping rob the Sierra Nevada Casino and dead money. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, definitely not a not a Nevada reference well, at all. Well, come along, little. I wonder stuff. if Vera can figure out that you're part of the Inspirious lineage. Might little might be a little bit closer to the forces of darkness side. I'll give her a d twenty. It's like, is this a drug addict or actually a creature of the ah? Uh... Oh, she know. <laughs> oh, she don't know shit. <laughs> nah, she doesn't know shit. It's okay. <laughs> well, you you see the look in her eyes, like oh, shit. Is she onto me? Is this some kind of fucking inspirious code that's about to be broken? And then you tweak a little bit. She just seems to relax again. Like, no, it's just drunk. That would be crazy. There's no way that she's part of that line. That would be really uncomfortable. Uh, series of circumstances. <laughs> why would she be a? Why would a? Ro why would one of them be a rogue in the city of rogues? It would be weird. Surely they'd be off doing darknessy things, right? All right, come along, little sister slash cousin slash whatever, and let's go. I don't. I'm sure I don't look that much younger than you. Yeah, she'll follow in your wake. And then, yeah, she heads down the street immediately towards the church to go get your scrolls. I'll meet you at the bank, I suppose. Uh, as you might expect, I'm still not much of a fighter. Uh, but I will uh, join you if I have to, but I, no, you know... But when we go in, you, you and Juniper here hold up nice and safe. Very well. Leave that part to me. I'm hoping to get my kills into the uh, triple digits. What? What did you think I've done? No, you're crazy. We should be trying to take it as quietly as possible. Indeed. Did you see what I did to the last man? Oh, I did yell on guard. Fair point. Yes, this is a bank. Please keep in mind that most of the people in there probably won't be fighters. I have never killed a man that did, was not armed. I said I've never fighters, stabbed a man in not the back. unarmed. This is the fucking hollow show. Everyone has a dagger. Once you pick up all weapon in Everyone hand, you... Uh, as well. Once you pick up all weapon, you're fair game as far as I'm concerned. Let's restrict that to weapon in hand, just not on your person. Oh, correct. All right. I'm, otherwise, I'd be uh, stabbing women of the night. Or men. Or men of the night. Hey, yeah, or just people. In... Not just I... stabbing people at night. <laughs> <laughs> or people in the night. Yes, <laughs> Northy, you are coming across as a serial killer. Ah. You mean he wasn't? I'll have you know. I'm a I thought he was. I mean, he is a serial killer, but... He pretends to be a duel. Kill this bowl of cereal right now. It's fucking delicious. Cocoa Pops. Uh, uh, all right. Call back to Lieutenant Crunch. Yep. Emery's going to clamber up oh. onto the cart. Well, let's let's go. go look at the place. All righty. I am going to be in carousing. I have to stop back at the, at the <laughs> safe house. Sure, yeah, it doesn't That's take an incredibly get. long time to get around town. Uh, so, there are certain things to consider when breaking into a bank vault. You have the tool with which to break into the vault. You know where it is, and it's in the daytime. Yeah. How do you prepare? I'm going to scope out the security situation. I am going to carouse. I'm going to look over the place for entry points, I guess. I get back. I'm going to grab the uh before we get there, uh Fergus is gonna grab the same like uh desert cat disguise that he had from the first uh uh heist. Sure. To also case the place. And yeah, I couldn't I couldn't help it when I was like, I've got all of the thieves here, there's no way I don't do one payday map. <laughs> yeah, okay. So let's see here. 
Amirian, your investigation shows that... Well, uh, with a 21, ask me two questions. And you can walk into the building. It is still a bank. Well, first of all, how many guards are there? That you could see, none. That's alarming. <laughs> yeah. With a 21 investigation, you know of evidence that this place is guarded, just that those guards are kept out of sight. Possibly non-humanoid. Hmm. All right. Then follow up, and I guess I'll probably need to roll Arcana to supplement this, but uh, what's the magical security situation like? Uh, give me an Arcana. All right. Woo! Wow. Okay. Uh, they have a bunch of things that seem to you to be more like storage cupboards, uh, but there is a thumping great load of magic coming from them. That might even be where the guards are. The vault itself is terrifically magical, and there is a tiny magical bell on the front desk. Mm-hmm. I'll even bring you to the bank so you can see it. I'm sure lead it to acquire a scroll of silence. We have a... Uh, I got that. Yeah, we have silence. Yep. You have the actual silence spell? Oh, fuck yes. Okay. Yeah. Yes. As soon as we go loud, I need you to th just throw that onto that bell. Yeah, thankfully yeah. that's a ritual. Uh, you cannot cast that as a ritual when we yeah. go in. It takes ten no, minutes to it takes ritual cast it. You could stealthily position yourself and begin casting it and begin when it happens. Uh, yeah. Look around the place. Yeah, that's what there, I was thinking. There. It, is, it is entirely possible. As I say, it's a bank. Um, you can make a deception or a stealth to walk around completely freely. DC is 15. Okay. I'll just... I'll just I will it. use my inspiration. Fair. There cool. we go. Yeah. So, you can see that there is a, a very large kobold. Um, he is dressed more like a bard than a bank teller. Uh, he has the the poofy frilled jacket, like uh, voluminous man skirts, aka the kilt. There is an instrument underneath the desk, uh, where one would like you know hide the shotgun where it's it locked in. He's got a pull away for a, a loot just in case of emergencies. Yeah. As far as kobolds are concerned, these are these are handsome, handsome lad. Yeah. Nice. Pets, do you actually have silence prepared today, though? Of course, yes. I, like I said, I'm a reflex caster. I can swap one out a day. Yeah, but wait. You can swap one out yeah. when you take a long rest. Yeah, when I take a long rest. We're not taking a long rest. You're, you're not taking a long rest. No, I already have, well, I already oh, yeah, have silence prepared, is what I'm saying. Okay, that's what oh, I was okay. asking. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Yes. Okay. It's like, okay. I can't change them out on the fly here. It's like... Yeah, it's just, like, I was... That's one of those spells that I wouldn't yeah, expect I anyone to have prepared ever, so... That's because the Dark and I were talking I, I asked <laughs> to. All right, well, yeah. fair enough. Then. It was incredible, incredible forethought on your part. Yeah, really. Yeah, I have silence uh, cast not trace. Mainly. Yeah. I mean, we need look, if, there's, if, there's, if there's ever a campaign to have silence prepared at all times, it's a thievery campaign. Oh, yeah, for exactly. sure. Exactly. Yeah. All right. Uh, let's see here. Uh, yeah, your stealths, deceptions, they look fine. You can walk around and take a look in the place. Uh, Saving, are you entering as well? Uh, I'm going to wait until Fergus hits back so he can dump inspo on us. Just in case. Sure. Sure, sure, sure. But yeah, once... Yeah, my, once stealth, my stealth is two and my deception is minus one. I'm not going in. Okay. I mean, I guess I, like, I I could have done it on the way. Yeah. I'm sure. We just need Fair you to, enough. like, sit in the back of the card playing sure, your yeah. instruments so we can uh, get our inspos back. Sure. So when you get around the back corner, you can see that there are bars with, like, lovely warm sunshine coming in. Uh, they are barred windows, so it's like a lovely, like, wooden set glass windows, uh, but there are bars, like, the wrought iron curved gothic ones on the outside of the structure. The stone walls look to be pretty damned thick. 
but it is a richly appointed bank, that's for sure. It looks like a piece of luxury. The floors have that beautiful clickety-click-clack and are spotless clean. The bard will watch a couple of you approach. At least one of you will go. Um, indeed, uh, let's see here. Rye bread, yours was a deception. Excuse me, sir. Have you come to leave money with our delightful establishment? I was ve I was uh, about to make the joke of um, I just flashed a badge that said FBI, but it was Federal Booby Inspector. Nice. Sadly, uh, you just you just throw you just thrown that amazing idea into the toilet. Owned. And she did you get in hollow bars? Two hundred GP each. Oh shit. Yeah. Yeah, she paid out. She paid out pretty hard. It is 200 GP each. Base. Alright. You certainly have the money to make a deposit with, for sure. Give me a second. Swig of Dr. Pepper. All right. The, uh, the uh, old fizzy courage. Well, do you, I'm thirsty. I'm I, there. I, I know I want that. I thought you didn't drink Dr. Pepper. I do. I, don't, I just drink sugar-free. Ah, okay. I love Dr. Pepper. It's a good, Dr. Pepper the and Cherry Coke are guilty pleasures of mine. The second best thing to come out of Texas, President Company excluded. Shucks. That's a pretty good thing. I didn't know that was Texan. Yes. It's actually from, I think it's from Waco, actually. Huh. Oh, Dr. Pepper float. Nice. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that might be enough for a night with Alba. She didn't work <laughs> at the boudoir. <laughs> no one said anything about it at the boudoir. <laughs> Oh well, yeah, you know. Yeah, who said anything about the six hundred GP is yeah, enough maybe, maybe, to maybe. get to take her out on a date, becoming of her. Oh, uh, of course, yeah, yeah. To just to fucking afford the restaurants. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's to afford the restaurants. <laughs> Fair enough. I thought it was like six hundred for a fucking blowy. I'm like, that's there. Yeah, no, not quite. But yeah, uh, so yeah the, the, bar, the bar calls out to you, Rye Bread. Have you come to make a deposit? Are you withdrawing on behalf of the business? I have come, in fact, to uh, uh, to see the uh, what, oh, what's it called? I'm doing a little bit of shopping around. I'm uh, somewhat of a nobility from the north, you see, and stand to inherit quite a great sum in seeking to move my uh, plans down more of the southwesterly way. Oh. And then just to check this money that you're expecting to come into from a mystery relative, you are sure this is legitimate? You didn't just receive it in a letter and they wanted the details to your bank? Correct. Okay, I just thought I would check. You can never be too careful. Unless someone managed to uh, perfectly mimic uh, Auntie's ve uh, uh, very tight scrawl. I wouldn't put it past them. Sometimes people can be very, very cunning. Copying handwriting as they do. Correct. In uh, any event, opening up a... Uh, I was thinking of opening up an account and putting in a down, uh, a down payment of... Uh, uh, what what's it, what, not down payment? What are they called? Deposit of a hundred a hundred gold pieces. But certainly, I could do so. Uh, I'm just would you like still... to be doing so under a nom de plume with code or? Just put me down as Ryan the Rye Bread Remington. Thank you. Ah, nom de plume it is. <laughs> well, in which case, do you have a recommendation or a business associate who will sign off on such statement? Essentially to announce that you are good for it. Uh, I know a lot of people in the city. Uh, 
These are yeah, you could you could you could definitely make a deception test and just fucking just flub one of your contacts out there. Okay. Deception. Button go. Fucking hell. Nice. Yeah, make up a business. They're clearly a legitimate business and definitely not a front. Um. Uh, let's uh, hang on. Is Northy good at keeping track of fake names? No, he is not. <laughs> huh? A stray, uh, stray, uh, a, a stray is nor Northy's probably not. Yeah, yeah. Well, I'm, I'm, I'm looking up uh, that fake business. That I, I'm sorry. Uh, it's the one that Coffeezilla uh made up, that just spells scam. <laughs> Yeah, I was definitely uh, wondering in character, but I'm glad you're good at keeping track of these. I am. Mostly because I, uh, I not only have them writ all written down, but I also bounce all of my ideas off of Ben first, so they're also, like, uh, in this <laughs> uh, Amazing. So, Ben usually gets, like, all week of, uh, <laughs> a week of Sorry, I'm trying to read <laughs> uh, forewarning about what I'm doing, but it's just like, uh, I, where's the one? I scammed a scammer, so he couldn't scam me. There we go. All right. Yeah. What, what, what he business? Nope, that's the, uh, come obtain fun friends, enter exciting zones, indescribably lush, look out adventurer, which is spelled his name, Coffeezilla. <laughs> I have a happy blindo in my lap. No. Hooray! Yeah. I forgot his. Uh... Hang on. I, that's just because I'm reading. All right. I'm just gonna make one up. South Coast Armory and Masonry. Masonry. Well, there do seem to be a lot of businesses, and I suppose buildings are always being built. South Coast Armory and Masonry. And no, we found out that Northy's not good at keeping track of all the fake names because he didn't recognize one of them on the list that we stole. Yeah, one of the uh, ones on the list is uh, actually amazing. one of his non uh, yeah. Amazing. As well, yeah. South Coast Armory and the Masonry. Uh, who runs South Coast? Man. <laughs> now, you, no, I'm trying to think of funnier names, but I. <laughs> Hang on. I'm gonna steal one. Vernus Lambert Watkins. Watkins? Watkins. Watkins. Okay, Watkins. Not, not, wet ass pussy, not, not wet ass pussykins. <laughs> no, that's amazing. You should go with that. <laughs> All right, I'll read that. A totally legitimate business owned by Vernus Lambert Watkins. Ah, very good then. That's just fine. Uh, he opens up his uh, desk and pulls out a shelf. Uh, the shelf appears to have a number of like hinged latches on them. He reaches into his poofy doublet, 
opens up one of the hinged latches to reveal a security deposit box. If you would like to place your money within and sign receipt, we keep one receipt within the box, one with yourself, and another written here in book in triplicate. Alrighty. I'll go ahead and deposit 100 gold and then sign. Excellent, yeah. Uh, he has you signed three times. You keep one of the receipts, he keeps one, and the last one goes inside the box, at which point he locks the deposit shut, returns the key to his neck, and slides it back into his desk again. At the end of the night, these will be moved into more secure storage within. Well, I thank you kindly for your custom. No, oh, thank you, sir, for choosing us, and I hope that your recent windfall comes to benefit all of the Mason family. Just so you are aware, a portion of your earnings may indeed be turned into more money through a magical thing called interest. If you would like me to explain the complexities of interest, I can certainly do so for you. But the reality is, money go in, time passes, more money come out. No, I understand. The bank uses a, a money to seize a peacock farm and then turns over the peacocks for profit. Uh, how are you aware of the peacock farm? <laughs> and then, just thinking back, oops, I killed the owner in a duel. <laughs> Scratches his chin curiously. Ah, a busy day. Oh, well. All right, does anyone have any other questions about the place? Uh, no, because I failed, like, my check to, like, get any questions, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> Uh, you got a 14. Uh, you can ask one thing, you get a vague answer. Um, I was, I was thinking about, like, asking for entry points, but I mean, like, it seems like it's only the entrance here. Mm, it is possible that you could get in by some vertical route either above or below, but you don't see an obvious way to do so. It's just that, you know, there's no barred skylight that you can see. It's a flat roof. Similarly, much like many businesses full of illegal money, it's probably not too far from a sewer entrance. That's not a very good idea to do right now with how alert the sewers are. <laughs> How tall is this building? Uh, the building? 20, 30 feet. So hear me out. What, uh, are there, like, are there other tall buildings around it? No, no, Temple District. I mean, th there's, like, a... Uh, quite a lot of open space around most buildings here, and they're all quite low down because it's a cathedral district. It tends to be that the only tall buildings you see in places like that are the places of cathedrals themselves. Yeah, uh, it tends to be that houses you'll find are either like literally the flat roof ones, or they're mega shallow sloped, and they tend to only be one or two stories maximum. Hmm. So hear me out. What if we wait till close? We tip the drill up vertically, and we go in through this, and we cast silence, and no, then we, we go in through the ceiling. No. We can't no. do that. It's if it's already like closing time, it's too late. Al, the toilet's like, you have till closing time. You could try and take this idea to her and get more time. You have to persuade Alba, though. Or we could leave. <laughs> yeah, yeah, or you could leave the uh, broker in the latch. No, we take her with us. Now that we've extricated ourselves from the park. Uh, yeah, Do you think I she suppose. doesn't have agents just watching us to make sure we don't just try and split? I mean, I'm willing to fight her fucking agents. I mean, I mean, yeah, look, if you want the campaign to end that badly, yeah, you could just leave. Fergus thinks that's worth asking about going in vertically. I don't think it is. Because, like, my his, his argument for, like, wouldn't it be just hilarious 
if the people came in and the and the like the big door was still just completely intact it that's it yeah, it would be a that's, that's that's your only reasoning for it yeah. and also it would mean it would like mean we don't have to deal with any living like guards or hostages no we just have to deal with the impregnable stuff at night that's the door becomes impregnable at night I they said wrongly suspect the entire vault is one unit and this drill probably I suppose only like... works in the day is my guess in fact actually Emery's just going to take the time to okay. look at this fucking thing. Sure. Uh, the drill looks like it has a simple, like, metal stand. Someone has had the forethought to get a whole lot of, like, softened, boiled leather and wrap it around all the legs and make a platform of it. Just so it doesn't just, like, vibrate against the floor so hard it fucking shatters. Um, what makes it drill? And... It uh, it appears to be a magical device. It is a solid, like a, you know, like an old hand crank drill, just mm -hmm. one that you would twist and turn and push all the way in. It looks like that, but it's mounted on a tripod. Uh, there is an activation rune. The drill bit looks to be about two foot long. Uh, okay, maybe that. And probably like a thumb thick, so... Presumably it punches through, like, the turning mechanism of this wheel instead, or where the lock is located. Okay, maybe that might not be as effective. It's possible. It would take you a while. It's There is a possibility that you could, if you pass the engineering test required, punch enough holes in with a drill to make entrance into this, so long as the roof is less than a foot thick of stone. Yeah. Yeah, no. I I don't think that's a good idea. I mean, it's a good idea. I just don't think it's going to work in this circumstance. No, longer sure it's worth it. Honestly, I think our best bet will just be uh have you ever like tried to like dealt the um the diamond heist, right? You take out guards, mm -hmm. you get in there, you put everybody down on the ground like as quick and quiet as possible and then you just set up the drill go grab it and get out you know what i mean yeah it is possible that you could do this um stealthily but you know air quotes stealthily as opposed to air quotes no witnesses which is a very different way to end that diamond heist yeah the normal oh, way you can't call the cops if they're all dead pat 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 <laughs> All right, I think that was everyone's questions. Yeah, I think it's time to get ready to smash and grab. Uh, is right. so this door point? actually big enough for us to pull our cart through? Because if so, yeah, it excellent. is. Excellent. Then like yeah, it. the uh, the getaway. The cart. vault probably contains things large enough to be in a cart. Yeah, we should probably just pull the cart all the way in here so we can make a getaway faster. Mm -hmm. Uh, in fact, yeah, um, I'll probably have that be uh, Vera's job. Like, once we go in, just wait a couple turns and then come in with the cart. Sounds good. All right. Uh, and Vera gives you your cure scrolls and also gives you a bunch of masks. They look like happy clowns. Perfect. <laughs> of, course. <laughs> of course. I'm also going to, like, when we actually, like, get ready to smash and grab inside, I'm going to take a potion of disguise self. <laughs> but happy clown mask. Oh, I'm still going to use that, but I'm also uh, going to take a disguise self potion. That way, I don't look yeah. like myself with that on. Very clever. Yeah, I think Amy is also going to rip a scroll of disguise self and just like become a frumpy old man. That sounds like a good idea. I might as well mark off for that too. Stay a while and listen. And then you find out. Then you find out someone else's disguise self is actually just of a mirror. And like, oh, god damn it. <laughs> that would be amazing. You get a whole bunch of scrambled mm -hmm. disguise self scrolls, except it just picks another member of your party. <laughs> That'd be fucked. <laughs> I am. I, I'll, I'll mark well, out. just I'm one member of the to... party. It's just like six Northies. And that's fine. He's just like random human man. Yeah, it's true. 
That's true. That is right. And you, oh, that means you would all get to run around using a naughty non to play. <laughs> How dare you, handsome normal human man? Yeah, true. I'm going to uh, disguise myself to look like an actual gargoyle. Disguise self. <laughs> Very cool. All right. Yeah. Okay. So. It's probably, what would you say, like an hour before sundown? Uh, let's... Yeah, I guess. I think, like, maybe maybe two. To give ourselves yeah, a little, maybe, maybe two. little extra yes, breathing yeah. room there. Okay. In case something goes wrong. Yeah. Sure. In case you need to, like, fucking do a cart loop around just to make sure that no one's chasing Yeah, basically. You. Shake Lucia, pursuers. Lucia, Lucia yeah. yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah shake pretty pursuers. much. That is very true. All right, yeah. Two hours before sundown. Yeah, the plan is as soon as we get in here, silence goes on the bell and the bard, and we rush them. Yeah. Okay. Um, I will open up the turn order. Everybody get on the floor. Yeah. We'll (laughs) put you at the entrance. Um, I will leave the cart there, even though, you know, it's still outside for a few turns. Slide you over. Uh, Typical. You can put yourselves in any order out of this group that you would like. Uh, I'm a melee character. I'd like to be in front. Sure. Let's see, I think I should trade places with Red. Mm. Did, no. I'm no? a melee character. We're all melee characters. Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay, everyone is then. Yes. Fair enough. I... Yes, we are. Illusionist wizard. Oh, no. All right, I was trying to put that person on the ground immediately. <laughs> yeah, I picked uh, interesting NPCs, but none of them are renowned for having a lot of hit points, just to give you guys a chance. Motherfuck. It's fine. This is definitely a surprise round. They are not expecting this. Uh, all of you give me a stealth. We'll see if it's a surprise round when you just all turn up again. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Or deception. Either or. Did we have pass up? No, not this time. But you'll all have your. Uh, we should all have inspo back. Uh, inspo's yeah. back. Mm-hmm. Yeah, not that we need it right now. <laughs> yeah, I think we're. Uh, I think we're probably probably good. Uh-huh. Okay. Yeah. All right. Yeah. They will be caught off guard by your entrance, which is very convenient. All right. It begins, Rybrad. Now that I think about it, didn't you say the money was safe with the Masons? Yeah, this is... Aren't we robbing someone else other than the Masons? Yeah, you're you're robbing the Varai right now. Oh. Then who's the... You said the noble and Okay, the... so, so Broker tried paying you for stealing with from Mason the Masons money. using stolen Mason money in the first place. Miss Mason right. came along and said, you can keep that fucking money and whatever the hell you want this plan yeah. for, so long as you make sure the Varai hurt so much harder. Okay, but when I said, like, the Mason in the park, no. and you said it's Varai. No, he... The 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 bank guy said your mason money will be safe. No no no, I'm not here at the bank. Oh. I'm saying when I said like stuff at the park, you said that wasn't a mason here. It's a Varai. Yes. Oh, yeah, the the plaque the plaque uh, the boudoir belonged to the Varais as well. And that's who we were about to start robbing from. You you yeah. were about okay. to rob the Varais plaque. The masons got it first in order to get you to take a far bigger chunk out of their hides yeah. than a simple plaque. Okay. Oh, okay. So who is the bard? I, d- I have no idea the who kobold. I was talking to. The kobold is the bard. The this guy's guy. presumably the wizard. That's presumably the spy. Okay. The... No, oh, yeah, you're right. Okay. Wizard up there. So, yeah. Yeah. Jump the wizard. Yeah, yeah. Right. wizard, spy. Yeah, I'm going to jump the wizard. Don't Jumping worry. Jumping purely by looks. Yeah, you'd think it'd be yep. the other way around. But, yep. Yeah. You look at them. That's clearly a wizard. Yeah. I mean, also, <laughs> look at this. Also, look at this guy. Like, she's got the glasses, which uh, makes us know she's a nerd. But look at this guy. Yeah, I mean, that guy's got the fucking cool hat and robes. Yeah, see. Yeah. We don't know. Yeah. Wow. Although, I would have pegged him uh, more of an abjurer with that guy. Uh, just like a merchant to me, have, rather than like I, a wizard. I wouldn't, have, I wouldn't have pegged him at all. And yeah, he was meant to look <laughs> like a merchant. Yeah, exactly. See, he looks like a merchant. <laughs> anyway, that, that was the whole point. Anyway. Cool. 
and then uh, this is all non-lethal, so. Yep. For now. Yep, until she pulls a fucking weapon, it's Conk City. Yep. Whoop. Ooh. Oops, I... fine, I'm surprised, and yeah, you stealth that, remember? That's oh, right. Six, and a 16 yeah. totally hits. 21. 21. Please, no one stand right next to me. I'm a swashbuckler. We're gonna take away all my advantage. Move her into this. Chair. I mean, it doesn't like, matter if we stand her. next to her. <laughs> like, you still get like sneak attack. Mm -mm. Yeah, you, but you don't that get. Yeah. That, is, that is how that works. Yeah, you still get sneak attack from normal sneak attack rules, which is an ally next yeah. to them. You're just uh, just the, your ability to go mano a mano is a bonus. Amir. All right, I'm gonna trust a red heel to do this. I'm going to rush the. Bard here. Sure. Uh, all right. So let's see. How far away is he? It's a cool fifty feet. So I'm gonna have to bonus action dash to get up to him. Uh, can I use my interact action to just like push? Actually, you know what? Hold on. Fuck. Yeah. No, I'm just gonna bonk the shit out of him first of all. Okay. Alright. Uh, what bam 25. You jump up onto a surface, which, as we all know, is an important part of playing D&D. &D. Yeah. <laughs> Hop onto a jumping, thing. Jumping, jumping onto a thing. is. I found that I do that more often than any ability I ever use in that game. Jump, jump. Yeah, I, I am amazed by how many times I'm jumping and then shoving people off of stuff. That's... <laughs> It's jumping, shoving people off of stuff, or, like, you know how I defeated the warp spider, the warp spider queen? I... By just shooting the webbings out from under every time she would teleport, and she died by fall damage. Anyway, um, can I, like, put a hand on the bell to just, like, secure it? Uh, you used your bonus yes. dash. Yes, so I don't, don't, I have an, an interact action, action still, which is normally used for, like, picking something up or whatever. Uh, yeah, 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 I guess, but you're trying to play bodyguard to it. Yeah. I'm gonna say okay, no. that's fine. Then, yeah, I need Ronts. need the silence going up. All right, Wasp Britica. Eight. That's one move action, but are you casting silence? What space is he in? Uh, I'm putting there. Okay. Uh, silence. Yeah, it's is... a twenty foot radius. Yeah, so... in one spot. So I don't think that one can't be attached to a thing, right? I would e... suggest. Yes, it can, I think you can attach it to the desk. <laughs> He's at. Yeah, you... I would suggest He's just. The desk. I would suggest just putting it on his oh. spot so it reaches the door, so we can also use it for the drill. Yeah, yeah, like yeah, put it in the radius. square, and that should get center at a point. So yeah, that can't be moved. Yeah, so. yeah, that's yeah, fine. You can just like center it here or whatever, and you get twenty I mean, foot. This square yeah. I'm pointing at to gets like, okay you know, the front of the door. Yep, that sounds good to me. Okay. So I've had the Payday Two official soundtrack playing the entire of time. Of course. Hell yeah. And yeah, I have yeah, the of course. Panther theme on one hour. Oh, of course, yeah, Let's absolutely. See. That's a good choice. <laughs> Let's see. Okay, perfect. Yeah, I think that's it for now, unfortunately. Yeah, I mean, hey, silence good. Is there any role associated with it? I don't remember. No. Silence concentration. No. Oh, it's yes, concentration. It is concentration. I hope though, you yeah. don't. I hope you don't I, get hit by the guy next to you. I don't know why you got up with him. Uh, I didn't realize I. Was I was still. Yeah, oh, you can you can back up no, if you it, want. It's a, yeah. Silence is a hundred and twenty foot range. You can cast it from so yeah, I can, far. And so I mean, the same. reason to get up to him would be to yeah, make oppies just... on him if he tries to go anywhere. But yeah, I think keeping silence safe would be true. more important Let's this see. round. Yeah. Then yeah, I'll I'll not move up then. Just cast okay. silence. Alrighty. Uh, I'll give you a little a little marker. Are you putting it on him? Uh, I'm putting it on the. Uh, there's a whole spot we picked out. Yeah, there. Right there, where the Guardian's point. I can't even see Guardian's point. Oh, no, there I can. Okay. Okay, so this is the square you wanted? Okay. Yes. All right. Uh, I'm uh, just 
dupe this dude and use him as a token. Nice. Right. Foot. Square. Let me get a nice soft teal. There we go. Nice. <laughs> There's... Yeah, Booming Blade doesn't have Verbal Combines, which is wild. Nice. Yeah, it's kind of crazy. Normally with a Blade spell cantrip, you'd expect it to be like... Also, what, in style... And somatic. Yeah, right? What What is it? It's just uh, Fun fact, somatic and material. Are immune to thunder damage. Somatic, I think, right? Oh, yeah, yeah. 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 In, yeah. in silence, you don't take thunder damage. There's no point yeah, doing Booming you're, Blade. You're immune to thunder damage. So you just wiggle your fingers around the hill? Just squeeze it real good. Red, you're gay. Okay. Well, first up, we're going to do some movement here. Uh, remind me, with uh, two-weapon fighting, does it actually use up a bonus action still, or is it a part of the attack action? Not the attack. But okay. Bonus action, unless you have the light mastery. Did you have weapon mastery? I have weapon mastery, but that gets, like, uh, the Vex on it, not the light. Yeah, thing. only only Nick makes it part of the attack. Oh, action right, yeah, instead of, of a bonus yeah, action. Sorry, yeah, yeah, yeah. It is. Okay. Do I have a? All right, that's fine. Do I have a symmetry? All Give right. Me... Uh, so first up, short sword. Let's see here. The sword of short. Seventeen for five. Yep. Where does that put them? Do I need to use my side my side eye first and foremost? Yeah, you need to unload on this bitch. If... Yeah, yeah. Five, yeah. five, five is kittens of damage, I'm afraid. Okay. Well, we'll roll that psionic force. Let's see here. Six more for that. Okay. Uh, short sword again. 17 to hit. 17 is a hit. Uh, six damage. Okay. More kittens of damage. And then hand crossbow. 24 All for right. seven. You drop her. Unfortunately, the hand crossbow was the one that doesn't do non-lethal, so she is now dying. Yeah, I mean, that's fine. We can stabilize her. This is more important getting them on the ground. Sure. All right. The bard shouts something in alarm. Uh, you mean they uh, wobble their spy. mouth in alarm? Yeah, 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 yeah. They shout something, but you don't know what they shout. No one knows what they shout. Spy as well is still off guard. Fergus. I'm going to. Attempt the shove action as an unarmed strike on him. Okay. To push him to the ground. Nice. Interesting. Knock his ass prone. Yeah. Oh, his AC is not fantastic. That doesn't matter. It's a saving uh, throw. He makes a yep. He makes a strength or dex save DC fifteen. Ooh. Dang. Bonk. All right, you shove him. He is prone. All right, uh, he becomes sideways. Now do it again as I put my foot on him and attempt to grapple him to the ground. All right. Uh, oh, Same luck, buddy. save. Oh, that was the bot. The, that roll wouldn't have saved Bonk. him anyway. All right, I'm holding him down. I will, like point at him and then, like, put a finger to my fake gargoyle lips. He says something. You can read enough lips to be like, no fucking shit, I'm quiet. <laughs> Rye bread! Oh, why'd you, what'd you do that for? And I'm going to stabilize this woman. Cool. Did don't want to come over and help me. Uh, with the do bar. I have? Oh, okay. Uh, uh, wait, I don't have a. Uh, I'm I'm so used to having a herbalism kit. I'm so used to being Hallie. All right, leave me alone. Yeah, you're you're a damage I dealer. Don't, I don't have stabilized. I have the healer's kit. I don't have stabilized. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, yeah. Ha ha! I will shout on guard, and then, oh. These are just clerks, right? Uh, he is a bard, and he is working as a clerk. He has an under-the-desk loot, just in case he needs to, like, fuck you up. But it's still right, in the realm gonna, of silence. Yeah, and I'm gonna and punch the other guy... Him. Yeah. I'll punch him the in other the guy is not actually there straight. Like, this one is just a token for silence. I'm yeah. gonna punch him in the schnoz with uh, the basket hilt. Cool. 
Hell oh, yeah. fucking hell. Yeah, you schnoz him real hard. He becomes a plank. Uh, I can use... I, uh, oh, wait. Uh, isn't it uh, Fergie that has... Yeah. Um, I am I a rogue. Hold. I will go over here. He'll be holding out the... Uh... I can only move over here. Yeah. Because I moved, attacked, and then uh, cutting action, move again. Yeah. Okay. Illusion is wizard. Sucks to suck. I mean... Alright, well, these guys... <laughs> the bar just went down, so... I am just gonna come over here. Actually, I'll... I'm afraid of touching the bell you now. You have a Halo's kid to stabilize the woman, right? I mean, yeah, I do, but she she's guaranteed to live at least one round. She can't possibly die. She just... Oh, yeah, no, she can that. possibly die. She just did her, like, a death save. Yeah, see? She, she, she cannot possibly she's, die. Okay. She got a 16. That's a success. Alright, fair enough. Yeah, my bad, I'd actually forgotten her all that. Alright, anyway, I'm gonna... Bonk this guy while he's on the ground, I guess. So I'll get my sneak attack, but no booming blade, alas. Uh, you can booming blade. It won't do it. Yeah, anything. I mean, you know, if you want to Amy's probably just booming blading on instinct. Or actually, yeah, no. Where's the boom? Where's the earth shattering? Oh, crit you the you fucking fuck fuck down. You crit his fucking skull pound open. That was some incredibly well Uh Damn, So that's sneak just attack. a sneak attack. Uh, and then... <laughs> full to um, death in one staff bonk. Alright, yeah. Amy will then just... Like, like clearly um, where Fugs was pinning him yeah. down, you just, like, uh, uh, swapped hands and then just did, like, a golf club swing. And yeah, yeah, she's gripping it, like, with both hands right at the bottom, just whacks him over the head. And then we'll, just, like, backflip up onto the table. Get her staff back under her arm. Range ending them rightly. <laughs> Alright. Uh, yeah, I, I, I... No, I'll stay here. I'll Protect the bell just in case. I'm terrified of it. Sure. Gross. All right. I'll come stabilize that lady next turn. Now I move it. Yeah. Yep. Here, I will hand off the drill. Wait. You might as well just go fucking yeah, I'll hand off the set drill. the drill up. Yeah, you do the drill thing. Well, me? no, not. Okay. Well, I mean, you should get you. in position to help, but yeah. Yeah. Don't you have the highest strength score out of all of us anyways? So if anything starts to shake... Not you. No, Ross probably does. He's, the strength, he's a strength ranger. And it's probably equal to... Yeah, Gardens. I have 16. Yeah. yeah. Oh, I have 17. So. Wait, no. Okay, I have... well... I have 18. There you go. Yeah. Okay, never mind. That way you, still... you, you can hold right. the drill and make sure it doesn't shake out of your grasp. I mean, I was... Yeah, I was I planning to here. stay by the door to grab anybody if any, like, random civilians came in. Because I have uh, the best chance to grapple. Yeah, that's fair. We'll have we'll have Ross set the drill. Right, you just go with drop it and North can ferry it over. Oh, yeah. I I feel like I should just clarify that was a non lethal hit on this guy. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Okay. So you're in position. Anyway, I think that's my turn for now. Big old dash. Okay. Red. Okay. Uh, I've seen people get miraculously back up before, so I'm just going to stay where I am and ready in action in case this woman has a spontaneous surge of health to, to get back up you to uh, put her back on the ground. You could her so that she doesn't try and get up again. Yeah, about that. Uh, I have a zero in medicine. That's a 50-50, so? but it's, it's more efficient to, to 10, just yeah. stay there in case, you know, she does roll a 20. I guess so, yeah. It's more yeah, guaranteed. That's why I'm say. just going to ready in action for uh, putting her down in case she gets back up. Okay. Vegas. He's going to go prepare his huge meat hands. Yep, I will hand, uh, hand the drill off to Northy and then uh, wait like in the back of our cart. Kurt's technically not here yet. Uh, the, cart, the cart isn't technically in here yet. It will arrive oh. in another town. Oh, okay. Wait, who's bringing the Vera. cart in? Vera. Vera, okay. Okay. 
who's driving this thing? In that case, I will like wait by the door to like grab if anyone comes in who isn't uh, Vera and the cart. I'm sure. I will grab them. All right. At the top of the turn order. Uh, actually, wait, no, yeah, actions happen on a 20, don't they? Layer actions uh, do, yeah. They do, they do. Uh, but I mean, also just the ti- the, ti- the, ti- the counting layer. timer for just events occurring as well, because she it's not like Vera knows that you've got a 25.16 turn order. She turns up at the top <laughs> of the order. Alright, All right, that's my movement, and I'll open the thing. Okay. And I'm pretty sure handing so, uh, like opening up the case and handing it off is uh, that just the whole action? Okay, there we go. Yeah, you, you can go. you yeah, place it and unfold it. Someone will have to switch it on, but honestly, it will switch on at turn twenty once you press it up against the door. Like the crank begins to crank itself, and you can see by the sparks that it's cutting up and like the fucking buzz it's pulling out <laughs> the metal. It's probably horrendously loud, but you can't hear a goddamn thing. Hell yeah. <laughs> All right, illusionist wizard Chan. Can you do it? No. Does not get up and just receive an ass kicking. All right, that's one marker for her. And then, honestly, if you wake up like that, you should just wake up and just like pretend you're dead. Yep. And you will right. come like... over here, use her standard action to stabilize her. So, kick off another use of the healer's get. And. Uh... Mm. And yeah, I'm gonna just do an Arcana check on these uh, like cupboard things you said might hold some critters. Sure. Just see if they're still like passive. Yeah, uh, you can see one of the major closets is up there. Oh yeah, they're active uh, and activated. Oh okay. Amy is then going to use a bonus action. So let's see, it's here. Yeah, you can't shout to your friends, we've got company, they weren't here. <laughs> All right, yeah, she has just enough movement to leap over here and, like, grab Northy's shoulder and point after shouting to Red and Fergus. Shit. The golems are working up. Okay, this should be pretty good. That's unfortunate. wonder what tripped them. The vault being oh. launched. Uh, yeah, that fair. makes sense. Yeah, nothing we could do about that. That just has to happen. That makes much more sense as a security measure than the bell. The bell was yeah. a totally different kind yeah. of alarm. And a magical yeah. one, no less. But... Oh, would that have like, called the cops? Yeah. <laughs> Good enough. Yeah. So we so we just gotta deal with like the regular defenses rather than like the uh, the specials coming yeah. in. We don't have to worry about getting besieged in here, hopefully. No yeah, SWAT no team cloakers, today. No cloakers, no, no SWAT tasers, team, no say. Spanish bulldozers. No. I would like <laughs> to direct you to the first of these enemies. Let's see. Yeah. They are the SWAT team. They're, no, they're, they're not the SWAT team. They're they're just they are, what are they, they are humble, humble dozers and animated and... armors. Oh, okay. Special wings and teeth. Oh, animated armors. That's fantastic. Is yeah, it? that means we can sell them later. <laughs> That's uh, the truly great thing about yeah, animated armor exactly. is that they are guess, made yeah. of armor <laughs> that you can take with you. The wizards don't want you oh, to know fuck, this, but animated this. armors are free. You can take them home with you. Huh? Oh my god. Head head <laughs> Look at the fucking name of them. <laughs> it's with trust. I love it. <laughs> <laughs> this is fine. This is oh, that's a lot of them actually. That's fine. Security. Oh yeah, it's fine. It's just like five of them. It's good. It's yep, they're fine. still activating this turn, but you have checked and noticed that they are all activating. That's where they will be unloading themselves. Was. All right. Am I doing this then? Uh, things already on now. Yeah. Yeah, oh, yeah, on. it turned on, he said. Mm-hmm. So you okay. can go okay. Oh, okay. fight. Uh, they are, yeah, they are getting up and activating. You can see them sort of like folding out of cupboards and getting up. Uh-oh. 
then yeah, I, I can go punch that dude. Wow, oh, there's a bunch of them up here. Okay. Yep. I'm good. I let's see not here. Attacking? Okay. <laughs> I am. When you said I'm you're good, I thought you meant as in like that was the end of your turn. I was like, really? No, I'm I'm good with this. I'm good with the situation. Let's see here. Okay. All right, there's one attack. Yep, hit. Two hit. attack. And three attack. Hit. Ah. Nice. And it has a reaction. Okay. Missed. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> it can throw nets? Okay. Yeah, it's the net guy. Oh, right, right, right. That was the net one. Oh, no. <laughs> the fucking tasers. tasers. Lightning bolt. Oh, no. <laughs> I was, I considered it, but it would just uh. be so destructive to make them actually... Yeah. Uh, taser might be shocking grasp. Yeah, that, that'd be a shocking That's true, actually. Oh, but, I no, it's, it's, it's shocking a, grasp. Bots. Winner, it's, no, a, it's, it's, a, it's a joke on the Payday 2 taser. They, they shout lightning bolt when they do tasers. Yeah, they do. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay, here. Uh, 5, 10, 15, 25, 30. Uh, am I able to see the guy there? I feel like I'm not, really. Yeah, I mean, no, it's kind of through a wall. There, yeah. Actually, no, no, that wall, you can see where the pillar is. It, it banks the corner. You can see him. Enough to make a shot on him? Yeah. Okay. The wall ends, like, here. That's that's just the overhang from the top down perspective. Flap, flap. Twenty five to hit him. Twenty five is a hit. Nine certainly is not. Okay. Uh, well, let's go ahead and use a psionic field on him. Why not? Sure. Get him out of the way. All right. Collapses in a heap. Defeat. Cool. Uh, that looks to be it for me. I don't really have much of the bonus action right now. Sure. Vegas. Okay, here, and I will ready an action to... Uh, shoot my hand crossbow at any of uh, the securities that come up around. I guess they uh, come up around either corner. Okay. That's right. All right, we're at the top. Right, Brad. Gonna continue to drill. Since I'm the one holding the, the drill, drill the, the drill the drill runs itself. You do not have to. Oh, it. does it? Okay, yeah. magical. Literally. All right. It's time Just to on guard. Make sure to keep an eye on it because we won't be able to hear it break. <laughs> Ross has good perception. This is exactly the kind of situation I want to find myself in, and I'm not even kidding. All right. Oh. 17. I don't think that'll hit. This is plate armor, right? None of these guys have they hits. Bad. Oh. There was no way I was going to put like 8 to 18 AC people up against you. It just was horrible. See, I would have expected that to be honest. Yeah, honestly. Mm -hmm. Alright. Uh, no one here is ranged, right? Yeah, I can be. And Red, Red and I can do ranged oh. or melee. No one's dedicated to it. Well, it's mostly so I... because I can, uh, uh, actually, wait, hang on, I have fancy footwork. Um, no. I also want to on guard stab this guy and then do a little shuffle step back like this. That way they're not beating me up around the corner and I can get healed. Yeah, that's fair. Sure. Yeah. Okay. And on drills turn. 
it drills. All right, it continues to drill. Wait, how do I upgrade the drill? Come on, upgrade. Hold on here. <laughs> A good question. Ha. I figured you might want to keep drill, Chan, when this is all said and done, you know? I kind of thought they would make yeah, it. Yeah, I was expecting to have to give it back. However, if they do not make me give it back. Why would they? They, they aren't going to take the evidence home with them. You know, that's fair. Uh, yeah, uh, Drill Chan is in fact <laughs> upgradable. Based. Rad. I'm All sorry, right. how do we upgrade the drill now? We don't know how sure, yet, yeah. but we know we can now. Yeah, it's okay, because good. Scout, Scout typed in unupgraded. Yeah, it's on its card. Okay, good. Alright, this one's gonna double move. Uh, uh, Northy, you can do an oppie if you'd like. Uh, sure thing, yeah. It positions itself to kick over your drill. Oh hell no. Nah. Ah. Uh, a good stab. 17. Ross. Stop resisting. Uh, uh, let's see, I can't... Is that both attacks on me, or is that... Yep. This just... Okay, well, Guys, they're trying to kick yeah, over obviously. our drill. Uh, yeah, I'll take the five, I guess. Okay. Um, yeah. Now my health is correct. <laughs> Come here. All right. Well. Uh, hey. I keep the nice. Sounds good. Good. All right. Yeah, I'm just gonna spin around and just slam my staff into this guy's face. Plate. Uh, no booming blade still, because Lamau. Uh, wacko. Oh, bonus action to aim first, because that's the thing now, so I have advantage. And I get sneak attack. This one also okay. takes nine damage from my ready Bonus damage. action steady aim is so uh... overpowered. Bonk. Tell me about it. I deal with it every week in like my game. I've like heard, been used in a while. I've heard the story. All right. That's true. It hasn't been used in a while. And I'm going to move here to plug the gap so they can't move past again. All right. That's my turn. Okay. This net SWAT is defeated. Actually, wait. Oh, shit, I shouldn't take him off. Oh, well. Okay, this one's going to come up and punch an Orphy. Right in the schnoz. 16 and a 7. Uh, let's look. Uh, arm class is 15. Alright, so you get hit for 7 and... You hear it make a mysterious bringing noise. Well, I don't know what... What does 311 mean? Uh, on it, a 1d3, three, three options. So, three so it it's down. the third option there that says bring! <laughs> Look out for kicks. Oh no, people outside weren't alert to this already. They are now at that noise. Maybe if we defeat them quickly enough, it Maybe. will, uh, you know... Not transmit. Ross. Yeah, this guy. Sixteen. Oof. Hit. Oof. Wow, your damage. I'm gonna roll inspiration not, on that. Not looking strong. Yep. All right, go for it. Oof. Oh. Ooh. The sad vantage. Than that, yeah. That's a good hit, at least. Not for great damage, but... Okay. Red. Uh, is it more worth to try and stop the brain yes. guy down there, or should I go... Okay. I was thinking about, like, up here, because if they just keep wailing on Ross and we lose silence... That's... Eh. 
He can cast it again. Oh, it doesn't matter, but uh, thankfully it doesn't change anything, but I do need the uh, topple uh, D- DC 15 uh, constitution. Sure. Anyway, uh, I guess I'm going to try and get rid of the Breen guy. Actually, I need to come a little bit closer to him, I think. 30 foot. Yeah, I need to get 10 feet closer. Come a little bit closer. You're my kind of man. All right, let's see here. How's that? 30 foot? 30 foot. Okay. Uh, uh, actually, where did I start? Because it might be better to get it. I need to get 35 for it. Bonus action to do that. It's fine. Just double tap them. Yeah. Well, yeah. No, I'm. I was thinking like whether to get in and try and get like the Vex on and action swords using that. Yeah. Or to just just give him a double tap. Or just rat tap. Northy and I can take this guy out this turn for sure. Uh, okay. Well, let's try it. Uh, that's a miss. Does a fourteen okay. hit? Okay. Um, side eye. Oh, sorry, wrong thing. Uh, same damage, but same wrong damage. button to click. Yeah. Uh, so that's eleven. And since we're already using it, we might as well use the ability of our tat tat to do a haste action attack on it. Yeah. And miss. Ooh. I didn't give you guys AC to AC because it would be annoying if you missed a whole bunch, but like... It turns out, it doesn't matter what the AC is, we're still going to miss a bunch. I mean, it happens when I roll a 2. Yeah, exactly. Yep. Alright, Baton Boy moves up and gets an MRI's way. Guten Tag. Twenty-one. Uh, that will certainly hit, uh, and shield does have a verbal component, so I can't do anything about that. Bonk. He also begins to break. Oh, damn it. Oh, good. Because this is the guy I'm vexed against, too, so I have advantage to smack him around. Aren't you vexed against the guy that's already bringing down to nope. the southeast? Nope. The already injured one there already got a northeast stabbing. Oh, I mean, okay. Let me keep it track. Yeah. Okay. Okay, this, this is one's coming ideal. around to Puss Ross. This is Awake Stray, not Halley Stray. I like Awake Stray. 19 on a 20 to hit, to hit Ross. Uh, shield blocks both. Yeah, with what verbal components? Oh, hey, yeah, silence point? Right. <laughs> with what verbal components? Uh, oh. Damn it, you're right. Okay, well. <laughs> Hoisted by your own. Alright, give me, give me concentrations. Let's see here. This is such a good start, and now it's all falling uh, apart. No, we're doing uh, all right. Oh, oh it's now apart. it's all falling apart. Which means I can I can shield the second one, then. True. <laughs> all right, and you guys will begin to hear an ear-piercing scream. Oh, boy. Oh, well. Oh, boy. Uh, does that guy up north that hit also start breeding, or...? Uh, no, he's going to hang on to his encounters. Vegas, it's suddenly real noisy. Shit. What's a good cowboy shield verbal? Draw. Get, a, get along, little doggy. <laughs> I don't know about. <laughs> get along, little doggy. No, no, no. It's it's clearly just <laughs> the typical yeehaw because you just yeah, avoid being hit. Get along, real high. Mm-hmm. Draws for like when you do like your Dag or something like that. Dag Nabbit's also powerful. Yeah, it's got that's got flavor. Dude. All right, Fergus, what are you doing? I rage and I start hawking hand axes. I begin to throw. Okay. I begin to chuck. Oh yeah, rage applies to throw now. Hit. Then they always. And they have vex. So... No. 27 for 10. Yeah. It's just a mistake everybody made. Well, it makes sense. You're yeeting something. Yeah. That's why they changed it. 16 against you, Northy. Uh, 15. I will take both. Okie dokie. Did you just add those? 
I renamed the attack to Taser Fest for them. <laughs> okay. It, has, it hasn't changed, like, actual real damage at all. Against the Vexed Boy. That Hit. is a 15, and I am a prepared man. And I'm going to swig a healing pot. Smirt! Uh, all right, a drill's turn. Door kicks open. Vera pulls cart in. Uh, slams door closed again. Hey, Slaven. Put her on. She's not what I would call particularly strong, but. She is present. You could even put her real name on her card now. Uh, Don't we have a, a drill roll that we have to go through as well? Yep, that's Never do it. money moves. So it. Okay. Uh, well, she will be able to help you a bit before she runs away again. Uh, Drill Chan! Let's see what you've got. Ooh. All right. Hangs in there. Oh, my God. I'm so afraid, you piece of shit, Drill. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, this one gets up. Swingy, swingy. Crit <laughs> fail of 10. Amir! Okay. Uh, fuck. I'm going... Oh, this thing's breeding too, goddammit. All right, well, there's no getting rid of this many Breeze, so I'm just going to smash the injured one in front of me. Do, 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 do. I can put Booming Blade back on, too. Hooray. Uh, staff Bonk. Oh, Jesus Christ. Yeah. Oh, my God. Whack! <laughs> Obliterated. <laughs> what a one-shot him. From full. Uh, I should have stuck to my guns and just gone into Northeast Square and hit this guy. Oh well. <laughs> Fucking hell! Four six. Don't worry, I'm planning to go. Yeah. Out there and and whack the shit out that guy. Such good, good dice. That was nearly your maximum. Yep, Damn. that was uh, the best damage roll I'll ever have. Uh, screenshot that, and mm. yeah, uh, that's that's me done. All Actually, right, baton boy. No, there's no way I can hide here. Yeah, go on. All right, does it trigger again? Now, this isn't to do the extra damage or the heal. It's just to see if he gets another Bree. Oh, he does not get another Bree, you lucky, lucky devils. 21 to hit Northy and a crit. Mm -hmm. okay. And it's going to move move into the fray. Ront. All right. Go to this guy in my my uh, right. Sure. Swing one. Ooh. For still not great damage, but okay. Yeah, you're. I don't know where your damage rolls are at. It's just twos and ones and all of your fucking dice. I swear. Yeah. Still up. Uh. So he's he's pro. He, Needs a if he's not prone, he should make his check. Oh, he's still up. Let's try this. Down. That's the one I did the same amount of damage on the non crit. Yeah, and then yeah, exactly. Scimitar for my North Boy there. What up to North Boy? Mess. <laughs> All right, Vera. 
Uh, what's the range on this? Let me double check. She can only get Fergus with it. No, nope. time to dash. Oh, she doesn't want to run into danger. She's a fucking mook. All right, she charges. So well, too bad. She's one like us yeah. in this situation. Yeah. A good girl. Yep. yep. No. Shit, shit, shit. Why is that thing so loud? I thought you would silence. Yeah, then they punched Ross real it hard. It didn't work out. Damn it. Don't worry, we'll get it back up in a second. Not even that hard. Red. Uh, okay, so that thing down there is still breeding, right? Mm-hmm. Okay, let's, let's, let's stop that. Shall we? So we're gonna move to here, and then it's time to start hitting. Uh, one, twenty-three hit. Yeah. Like AC fifteen. Okay. Uh, then twenty-four, then bonus action sixteen hit. Uh, yeah, yeah all hits. Okay, uh, is it still 16. up? No. Did it go down on the third okay, hit? Good. Yep. Cool. Let's see here. Where was I? I was like here, yeah. right? So that's like twenty foot. You could get so all I can the way move in. back ten. Or do that. Yeah, I mean you've got this handle down here. I might want to like get back up towards like Ross yeah, that's and like fair. get rid of that stuff up there. Just throwing whack chat fucking Drake's dragon porn. <laughs> this is a jolly little Oh, let me just... That's clearly how this bot is dressed. Hell yeah. <laughs> the same thing. <laughs> oh, I love him. This from BG3? Uh, yeah. Right. Yep. yep. Amazing. Vegas! Well, let's get... Time to do here. your big Vegas so... move. Uh, so Ross can... What's the big Fergus move? Back up. Swing again. They're all big mm -hmm. Fergus moves, that's the thing. Smash. Okay. What's the big Fergus move, you say? Get on the goddamn ground. Oh gosh, more of these Bomb. topple nerds with their topple. Cast you. No. At least I went over. with something different. Uh, no, yeah, have also him. topple. No, have him also topple, but at least it's not a trident. On grapple. You Let's take that back. Grapple. Riser based, you motherfucker. Fucking strength. Ha ha, no, fuck you. Grapple him. You're right, you press him to the ground on hog side. Yep, hold him on the ground with a foot. Yay! And that's what is gonna try and net right red. Damn it! All right, takes a punch. Ouch! Uppercut. Kerpow. <gasps> uh, you know what? He should use his power as well. Heal five! Get in the fight, robot. <gasps> oh, he heals a friend. Oh, no. That's less than ideal. I wonder if he's still vexed. If you hit him last round, uh, he should be. I don't see why he wouldn't be. Yeah. All right. Well, he's one of the ring ones, so I'm just gonna. All right. Recheck. Uh, eh. All right. He does not re again, so he's just gonna do two normal swings. He does not get the bonus damage. It's just to check to see if he breathes more. Six damage. Bah, bah, bah. 
Ouch. All right, Rabbit. All right. This fucking well, guy didn't stay dead. This guy's vexed still, so. The audacity. Put him back down. Swing my sword, uh, swing my rapier around, and because I didn't have to bonus action steady aim. I also know how to heal. All right, Mr. Brain huh. goes down again. I'm glad I spent a lot of my money on just potions of healing. Oh, that was just a pop. Clever. <laughs> All right, Drill Chan. No, yeah, I have four of those. Oh, <laughs> oh. Dude, it continues to fucking it, 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 it works, but barely. Yeah, yeah, you can definitely see that it's just like it's kind of a miracle that it hasn't jammed up already. It's like just hogging out chips of metal lock slowly. All right, Baton Boy is being grappled, eh? <laughs> just gonna make disadvantaged swings against Fagus. Yay! No. Against distressed the robot, no distressed robot noises. It's gonna try and either real heal at this point. All right, he gets one of them out. Shit. So are they like touching their friends to heal them, or what? Uh, they appear to be shooting out little lines. Okay, so that's an ability that would yeah. work at range he... if they wanted to. Mm, possibly work at, at best, like, 10 okay. feet. It did work at range. He did a move when he did this oh, okay. guy. Yeah. yeah, you don't think you could reach much further than that. I can't make him Unlike move. the regular taser, they're giving them the healing tasers. Hey. That was Baton Boy's big move, and that's all out. Oh, they could net Boy it. gets up. Damn. Oh, he And then throws a net over both of you because it's really funny and you're lying down. Take that. <laughs> Crip you with a net. Four damage. Damn. You are netted as, as this sharp edged net digs into you. You are now stuck on top of the guy that you were grappling. And then it hits you with the tears of fist. <laughs> Damn it. Nope. What is going on right. up there? <laughs> Doesn't matter. All right. Wait, who's netted? I'm going to move in here. I uh, will use a bonus action to steady aim, just for crit fishing purposes, really. And then is it a steady aim if you haven't moved? Oh yes, that's right. I I cannot, in fact, do that. Yeah, I'm not okay. allowed. Fair enough. Yeah. yeah, I will not do that. Um, and just whoop out. Oh, I wow. think that's going to miss. Sad face. That's a mess. I am... Shame, that was another really fabulous Yeah, I think I'm going to spend yeah. inspo to try that again. Sure. We'll just roll it a 20 plus 8 here. There we go. All right, that's you bad. hit. And I see you want for the attack to re-roll the attack as opposed to, to make another yeah, go. Yeah, I mean, you can't make another go. At... You're trying to keep your spicy... Oh, yeah, yeah, you you cannot, in fact, re-roll the damage. Alright. And yeah. then since I didn't have to do that, I will I use a bonus action to disengage and go back where I came from. So that I am sure. in the range of a bless. Alright, the healed swan come back. Rumps. Okay, was that net on me or Fergus? It's on Fergus. Okay. I'll uh as much as I'd like to silence, now I got two enemies on me. Yeah, you should probably No, it, I mean, it's they're time. on me. It's fine. Listen, I can take yeah. care of them. In fact, yeah, actually, why don't one, you just okay. soak the oppie, get out standing. of there, and then put silence up. That sounds fine. In fact, you could get one silence to cover these two idiots, too. That's true. You just put it here. That covers the entire door. Yeah. yeah. Uh, you should You should take the opportunity to attack first yes. before that, though. Of course, yeah. That's here. I was really hoping he wouldn't. That was the plan. <laughs> All, right. All right. Yeah. Okay. okay so uh, get so we get one, one disadvantaged swing. Miss. Mm -hmm. And one... Oh, wait. Netting you. That would be really funny. Damn it. Oh. Oh. 
Uh, I would absolutely have still revived that if it hit. Beating, <laughs> fucking pin you on the ground would have been so good. <laughs> All right, you get away and get the silence up. On Vera's go, she pauses, like skids to a halt before she charges headlong into the silence. She goes, oh, thank God. Uh, you three be blessed. Uh, Fergus, Red, nice. and uh, Amir. Yay. Oh, good. I'm about to roll a lot of dice. Sorry, Red, Red. I didn't even notice. It, I didn't even notice in his element oh, driving. Perfect. All right. And then she'll move 30 away. <laughs> what better way to make sure her concentration stays up than to fucking leave? Understandable. Have a nice hey, day. it works. Understandable. <laughs> she, is, she is the acolyte stat block with her whopping 10 hit points and uh, 10 AC. Yeah. 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 Red. Okay. All right. We're going to move up to here. And we're going to start with the very injured guy here on the left. Just try and get rid of him first and foremost, shall we? Uh, short sword. Does nine get rid of him? Nine on, on net boy? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Right. All right, you've been... And then continuing on. Uh, hey, look, another nine. <laughs> uh, bonus action. Hand crossbow. All right, that's uh, disadvantage he's lying down. Oh, is he lying down? Oh, right, he's lying down. So that's a 14, then. But that 14 is a hit. Cool. Magic fucking uh, pixel, baby. I think you mean he's dead, baby. Side eye. Right. Well, at least I took a resource away, I suppose. Hey, look, look I've been using him like crazy anyway. Oh, yeah, yeah. You've, been, you've been choking them down, but they're really doing their work. Yeah. All right, yeah. Fergus, we need you to just throw tridents this man to put him down. All right, that is oh, for me. Well, that's unfortunate. Right? No, oh yeah, you're yeah. that on you, yeah. Yep. I was gonna say no, you're not. I just killed the guy, and then right now. Well, I guess yep. the guy's yeah, dead. Yeah, you're now on neck to an unconscious robot. Yeah, that doesn't uh, help. Wait. Presumably, it weighs a fuck what's ton. The, what's the range increment on? I believe it's twenty one twenty or twenty sixty. Oh wait, never mind. Whatever the don't stack. armor is. Uh, I, I reckless attack and stick one of my arms out with a trident. He's <laughs> just recklessly flinging uh, trident to the ground. All right, uh, rock and roll. Let's see that dice roll. I'm gonna say on a one or a two, you fucking nail one of your friends. This is dumb. That's shit. I'm fine with that. Just hit me right in the ass. <laughs> like, just catch it betwixt your cheeks. I, I recklessly throw a trident from the floor under a net at an enemy at extended range. It's like the fact that I'm allowing you to do this without going, I don't care what up, the book says. Comes you're up wrong. through the net. <laughs> through the, the net, yeah. <laughs> We got All right, sharp bits. All right make, the, make the attack. Yeah. It's I shouldn't even be letting you, but it's because it's so dumb. But the book says you can, so go for it. Gee! You fucking hit. Uh -huh. him. You really hit him, and you hit him for nothing. Drop him. Ah, yeah. oh, dicks. <laughs> All right. All right. <sighs> Swat defeated. Oh, we still in initiative. We are still in initiative. Yeah. The Things gotta count. Right, Brad. Because that piece of shit drill can jam. I mean, yeah, but. <laughs> and you guys made some noise for at least a few yep. rounds. Yeah, like two rounds. Two whole noise. rounds. It's like two rounds. Yeah, still right. 12 seconds of like yeah. horrifying metal screeching and two robots going. Is bad. That's yeah, bad news. That's, that's, that's not, not that's ideal. True, yeah. <laughs> All right, right, Brad, you're up. All right. Just going to do uh, some fancy foot work. Sh -sh 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 Don't get out of arms. This reach. way. Of what? Of me, so I can heal you. Uh, well, you can move within Amy's move speed, in other words. Okay, well, yeah. I was going to stand right here and do E Classic on, uh, you know, uh, when you're. Uh, the standing rapier, rather than always having it out, just standing and just resting the blade in the hand. Oh, it's not course. covered in blood, so it's fine. That is true. And with this, I can get anywhere in the room within a few movements. As needed. 
a merit. All right. The drill has not jammed, thankfully. So yeah, I will just come up here and I'm going to cast Cure Wounds on the boy. Right, Brad. His buns were toasted oh, just oh, a little max. bit. All right, you sneak attack him for way more damage than he was healed on. <laughs> Block. <laughs> <laughs> pulverize him with a, heat with a, with a booming, booming sneak See, finger up the asshole. I was about to say, like, Amy obliterates you by crushing their fucking hips, not sneak attacking their butts. Uh, yeah, we'll, I will burn a scroll of fucking oil. Like you oil check, poor Norfe. <laughs> <laughs> Haven't had to cast Rumps. that in a long time. All right. Much appreciated. Let's sure. see. I don't think I need to do anything right now. All right. Vera continues running to the door. And she will double move and make to go through it before pausing partway to opening the door. Turning around. Someone's coming! Oh, shit. Just push the cart against the door. Just lie at them! What? That is a northy thing. Amy looks at the unconscious people. <laughs> She just I gestures a, at this gigantic door. Just lie at I, him. I have a great lie. Just sure. Yeah. I just Vera opens to. the door. Uh, Vera's like already opened the door a crack before she spots them. Before she goes, uh, excuse me, um, just the moment. The supervisor is coming. <laughs> and she closes the door again, before looking over her shoulder. <laughs> Red, uh... you did not hear this kerfuffle. Yep. That's fine. We'll see it, thinking about it. That's fine. I wasn't planning to do anything about that anyway. I'm going to move over to the drill. Uh, in case it does jam, is there a way to, uh, you know, restart yeah, you it? you can re ready an action to make an arcana test. The DC is 11. I, I okay. see I'm the drill so engineer on this fine. team. <laughs> this is fine. I have a plus one to arcana for yeah, yeah. Like the, the DC is super low. Basically, anyone, anyone can find the on switch if they give it enough effort. Yeah, I already in action in case the drill breaks down. Sure. Vegas. Uh, wait. I wasn't paying attention to why Red was there. Did you get me? No, you are not you... out. No, you've not been okay. afraid. <laughs> I tear out of the. Okay, okay you're, you're, you're fine. You're you're Ned, you can take Ned off. <laughs> right, Brad. All right, I got to get through the door. Mm hmm. I have so much movement. Yep. So. I, I can yeah. double move in uh, extra dash. Should we go this forward one? And yeah, when you peek out of the door, you can see that there is a businessman stood there. He's dabbing his brow with a sweaty kerchief. Excuse me, uh, sir, I believe I heard a most terrible noise coming from within the vault. Is everything quite all right? How long did it take? I can touch the, the guards if you would like. How long did it take you to uh, both hear and uh, hear that and respond? And can you tell me where you were stood when you heard it? Oh, um, oh goodness, I heard it for... I couldn't have even been more than ten or so seconds. Uh, but it was... I, I was just over there on the corner of the street having a delicious hot pie. Would you say you... Little street car. Would you say you could have heard it from further than that? Mm, possibly, yes. Uh, if the breeze had carried it, but you do have quite good soundproofing on these walls. A terrible din! What was it? Ah, damn. And then, uh, Northy will, uh, turn his shoulder over. Uh, turn over his shoulder. Uh, uh, Longshanks, make sure that, uh, you, uh, tune it up, uh, slightly louder. How loud would you say it was, sir? Uh, I would say from muffled, it was not the volume itself that was at its most distressing, but the ear-grating nature of it. I damned near dropped my hot pie out of fear. And he gestures once more at the cart for hot pies. Would you have heard it uh, better if it was, say, more shrilling? <laughs> better? That must be a, a, a phrase. If I'm not sure that shrilling would be anything you'd want out. Is this meant to be some kind of alarm? I wouldn't want to hear that ghastly noise ever again. We are testing security today. That's a hell of a test. Whatever happened to your jingly bell? 
Just in case that that is uh, brought out of order, do you know how easy it is to stuff up a bell? This is extra security for our patrons, you understand. Right. If it's for the patrons, uh, give me a deception test. Yes. Uh, deception. I will re-roll. Deception. <laughs> there you go. 26. I was about to say, I was going to give you inspiration, but the 26 works there. Yes. Uh, I suppose. I mean, they'd have to be very foolish people to come stealing from people such as yourselves. I mean, the grudge you would hold, I'm sure, would be incredible. Well, yes. anyway, I will be getting back to my hot pie. Jack terribly more at the cut. Uh, that, ter- uh, that was terribly inconvenient for you, sir. Well, thank you for uh, indulging us in this test. And then our uh, rye bread will hand him three, uh, three silver pieces. My goodness, quite a bit of money. Why are you asking for pies yourself? No. Uh, this was uh, uh, for the first responder that got here within a certain amount of seconds. A uh, reward was uh, in order because next, uh, f- for we intend to do these tests uh, bi quarterly. Oh, well. It encourages people, encourages people to keep their ears open. I suppose there are, goodness knows, a lot of noises that happen in this city where people will just pretend they didn't hear them, but not me, especially not during Pi Day. Correct. Thank you very much for your uh, uh, for your assistance, sir. I think we shall have to add a different mixture into the boiler of our sentries. Have a good day. And you. Yeah, he'll pocket the three silver and saunter off. Vera looks legitimately surprised. That was surprisingly clean, I bet. Uh, he'll shut the door. Uh, well, that was fun. Thank well you. done. <laughs> it, was a it was a good lie. I like it. That mm-hmm. was a very powerful lie right there. Now, of course you're supposed to hear the alarming, horrible, shrill noise. That's exactly what I would have done. <laughs> Hell yeah. Your old chan remains undone, nice. and you can see that it is about halfway through. Nice. As you said, it would take about a minute to punch nice. through, make a ten rounds, six seconds yep. per round. And we're going to do tests. Uh, but first, let's see if anyone else was in range when they heard those noises. Would you please roll me a d twenty? Think Stray should roll it. Could yeah. Could we have could we have a sort of modifier on it, given that a uh, when people are rushing towards it, a bit a certain businessman uh, might interject. Except you oh, said yes, that it was a test, and so you were getting feedback from people as they came in. Well, yes, but I said the first one, but it's true. The first one gets it, but you were specifically after feedback. I think he's probably not going to stop anyone who comes up to the door himself. <laughs> Fair yeah. Enough. He might tell uh, so yeah, them, though, is the thing. He might tell them. He might give you advantage to lie to them. Yeah, yeah, um, I'll take that. But he's not going to stop anyone else approaching if they come. Wait, so who's rolling what? You, d20, please. Oh, sorry. All right, there'll be one more person coming in a couple of rounds. Uh, we should. Pro- I'll probably just keep posted up here so I can lie to anyone who knocks on yeah. the door. Sure, Vera will use that opportunity to like slip out and go get Juniper ready. And let's see. Uh, all right, Drill Chan. Let's see here. Uh, it'll be three rounds when they arrive. So Drill Chan doesn't jam. Doesn't jam. Doesn't jam. Yes. Wow, this is the. This is. I'm sorry. I've given you an unfaithful Dice. payday experience. Hell yeah. <laughs> all right, I'm gonna take that opportunity to the go dream. cast. Guidance on uh, Northy, then hop back sure. just in case he needs it. Oh, yeah, I imagine there are other things you could have done too. You have three rounds. What do you guys do during those three rounds to prepare yourselves for the guy approaching? Uh, I uh, honestly, let's get the cart out of the way. I'll I'll go cast it and then okay. just haul the cart in. Sure. I am. I'm like going uh, yeah, yeah, get it ready. Uh, Fergus, you I'm could okay. probably hide these bodies, just get them out of the way, 
Ross there you do. go. When you said, ah, the cart, yeah. we should move the cart. I was like, what about the fucking yeah. I mean, look, I'm, I can only do one thing. I'll help move bodies. I will. Yeah, I'll help move yeah. bodies and then return to being ready to fix that drill. Yep. Yeah. Ooh, actually, can I steal this dude's loot? That's <laughs> oh, magic. Fuck yeah, you can. <laughs> it is? Hell yeah. Neat. Sure you want to I mean, we, we, might well, we might as well Greyhawk like the wizard and other yeah. people here as well. You never know what they might have all on right. them. So there you go. It is a loot plus one. It gives you plus one on all tests. Holy shit! Them. And when used as a instrument for casting bard spells, it increases their DC. Hell yeah! Neat. I guess it would be called like a loot of the Bob. Loot of the troubadour. Bard. Yeah. Uh, no, because no, I think there already <laughs> is like there are set instruments that do those effects and have come with spells. Uh, no, those are yeah, specific are. instruments <laughs> for different bardic colleges like the uh, Falklick and Bandur. Well, they're it's not just... for specific colleges. They're just like bardic instruments. That you no, no, they are. You they're not for specific arts. subclass colleges. They're for historical D and D colleges. Yeah, like the Falklick oh, okay, okay. school. How about the? Uh, how about the wizard and the spy? What they got on them? Okay, there you go. Loot of the Troubadour. I'll give it its handout in a sec. Uh, in fact, I'm going to be super lazy, and I'm just going to give the handout to save it. No, 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 I'll do it. <laughs> I, I can fucking... Fucking... Oh, man. I've, I got I an item in BG3 that uh, lets me... That gives extra bardic charges and another item that lets me restore bardic charges as an action. It's so nice. So it's the glove? Yeah. I also know that that sword that you use is also a bardic sword. It comes with a... Yeah. Sword. I'm very well fed I'm in this game. I accidentally locked myself out of the the Oof. the kid's shop. Oh, neat. Uh, pop that in with the other magic and more items. All right. The spy had on them a forgery kit. Yeah, he was just a legitimate businessman doing legitimate business. Mm -hmm. uh, you can see he's got a deposit slip for a box here. Ooh. Uh, it identifies this man as Salazar Briarhawk. Uh, you can make a history check. Sure. Sure, why not? Ooh. I haven't passed a single one of these before. I'm probably not going to pass any one of them now. Uh, Salazar gotcha. Briarheart is a hey. very popular infamous smuggler. Oh. You know, maybe we shouldn't steal from this guy just not to get on his bad side. Yeah, yeah, no, I'm good with just leaving this guy as a safety deposit here. I have Hi. a better recommendation than leaving his security deposit out of everyone else's because that looks real dodgy. Yeah, 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 put, yeah, yeah. Put his safety deposit money in his pockets. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, no, no. We'll actually, that. hold on. It, if he takes the fall for what we do, that's even better. What are you talking about? Also, or... uh, my deposit wasn't uh, transferred yet, right? Correct. It's in, a, Leave... it's in a security storage case using a key that was on that bard's neck. Leave that where it is. Sure. Okay. You're gonna, gonna leave just the shelves. I'm going to leave my 100 gold here because I'm going to be taking a bunch more gold. And I don't want my specific, this specific nom de, uh, nom de plume to be attributed to it. Makes sense. Okay. All right. So, tick eight comes around, the drill drills drillingly, and another person will uh, begin approaching and, like, moving to open the door. All right. Well, I did want to say that I, uh, my preparation is checking myself in a hand mirror and then uh, uh, pulling out a, r a rather expensive-looking tie around my neck. I do have fine clothes. That is very true. All right, yeah, you put on, you you change out of your crime tie and into your business tie. Correct. Coincidentally, the business is banking. It's also a crime tie. Zing. Yeah. So I will uh, open the door and stick my head out. Good, sir. How far away were you when you uh, uh, heard the alarm? Uh, this would appear to be a lady, and she pulled, comes to a a skidding halt, high heels click clacking on the stone. 
Why, I do declare, it was the most horrible noise. I do apologize, madam, but it is for our uh, customer's own protection, you see. Now, would you rate it as more of a shrieking or more of a booming? Last time we had too high of a shrieking, someone assumed it was someone being stabbed and no one came. Ah, oh, that's just terrible. No, no, if it wished, if it sounded too much like shrieking, I would not have come in case someone was getting stabbed. Correct. That is uh, what we were hoping for. Do no, have... this was a gravelly noise. Like someone had, I don't know, some kind of drill and was scraping it down against a wall or, or door, perhaps. It was terrible. We have a new uh, golem maker who has been making adjustments. Our first uh, attempt was at a booming variation, then a shrieking. Now more of a grinding well, yes, Grind would describe it properly. To be fair, I did not know that you had moved into your own Golomancy. I thought that security with ample trust were working with this establishment. We are a uh, we are attempting to branch out. After all, you do not expect this to be the only one of uh, the only place of its kind. If we were to try these experiments and say one of our branches in King's Seat, we would not want the gold cloaks pounding on the door. Oh, yes, I suppose that might be the case. Still, it's rather alarming to be alarmed so. That and my cousin, I believe, works with security with ample trust. I might have to tell him that he is being poached. Oh, I certainly don't believe so, though you are welcome to speak with him about the matter. This is a lateral move on the company's part. I see. And is the lovely Sir Jacobson in? I did want to speak to him while I was in the area. I am afraid no one but security staff is in at the moment, but I would be more than happy to uh, take a message for you. Oh, a message, you say? Hmm. Uh, give me a deception test. All right. I have Advantigo, and I will do a plus, plus four. 24, but yeah. Woof. Or plus one. 22. Nice. She pauses. He knew oh, well, he knew what I she was saying. suppose he must be terribly busy. <laughs> Honestly, I thought Jacobson worked with security. Alas, uh, you, there's no reason for me to be doubting you at all, sir. Especially not with this vault. And she pulls out a perfumed kerchief. If you could leave this for Jacobson, then let him know that I'll be in the area. And she pointedly uh, no. wiggles her brows and adjusts her flowy hat. And uh, oh. Ryan, the rye bread Remington, will pull out a pair of silk gloves and then take it in his hand and very carefully fold it. Of course, madam. Oh, look at you. A perfect gentleman, I must say. Much better than that kobold individual. I dare say he tried to eat me out. <laughs> well, well, you can never trust baths. Have a good day, sir! Understood, madam. And... Thank you for uh, uh, your uh, participation. My pleasure. She looks at you meaningfully and then lets the door close as she walks away. Click, clack, high heels. I just close the door and then... Uh, hmm. I should look... F uh, Northy is going to make a point that before he leaves... If he sees any, uh, to go over the desk and then leave it on whatever uh, desk has that name. Uh, yeah, no, these appear not to be worker desks, but scribing desks. So it's uh, business uh, banking accounts, like uh, check receipt books, that kind of thing. Well, uh, in basically, the back, where the gold uh, And also, there, uh, you know, there would also be a couple of eff effectively investment uh, individuals who could use the bank's money to invest, make money. Yeah, but the name that she left with him. Yeah, so Jacobson would be a member of security and thus probably doesn't have a desk. Yeah. Yeah, I'll leave it on top of... Uh, uh, surely uh, I can do uh, a look around and see if there's any, um, like, table with a, uh, like, 
uh, either a name or like you know work tools with uh, Jacobson's do not remove. <laughs> you know, what? yeah, there's probably a uh, a bench that's got a couple of like batons on it uh, that, and one of them has uh, JJ uh, in the initials because obviously his name is Jonas Jacobson. All right, and we'll leave or Jacob a... Jonas Jacobson, but he wouldn't, you know. Yeah, and we'll leave a note in scrawling text, uh, uh, sending on the message. Nice. He probably loses his job after this, but you know. But he might be able to get laid. Yeah, it swings and roundabouts. Listen, right. Northy's Northy's a good guy. Good, kind of. He's good adjacent. Oh my god, Gen the drill continues. Uh, what a gentlemanly. Good drill. That killed too many, uh, a bit too many people, but that's fine. He killed, stabbed a few too many people to be called a good person, but you know, good adjacent sometimes. He's a nice person. He's, yeah, he's nice, not good. <laughs> <laughs> All right, at last, the drill begin like like stops. Usually, you probably hear it stop screeching, but instead, it like stops juddering. It's spinning its drill bit now inside a hollowed out area. It looks like it's punched all the way through. All right, Amy is going to pick up Drill Chan and put him in the cart. <laughs> yep, you load the Drill Chan away. All right, uh, Fergus, would you like to do the honors? Say silently at the gesture, gesturing yeah. at Fergus. Gesture to the door. I'll... Just in case he can live. All there. right, to the door. Is it at the pull open stage or the. Oh, there we go. No. As solid black. Yep, I need to uh, do the. We've done it. Yeah, yeah, give it dynamic lighting. Whoa! Wow. That's a fuckload of money. Glad we brought the card in. Yeah. Yeah. The estimate was 20,000 gold. And you can see as well that there are a couple of nice bits and pieces, including, like, resting... It looks like someone's draped it out so that it's positioned across this like stone murals naked ass someone's dropped a cloak it has a like rich red and gold embroidery rich red and gold you say let's see this cloak here <laughs> yeah i think we know who gets dibs on that <laughs> yeah, go take wait a how dare you wait actually hold on let's check the entrance yeah let's check the traps for traps or anything we'll we'll uh, before you go into the vault yeah. oh, okay uh 16 Look safe to you, Captain. Actually, I can guidance myself because Ross can now drop the silence spell. Is it a verb? Um, yeah, I suppose. Yeah, you could drop the silence. 18. You don't detect any traps. Amy? Something doesn't feel right, but you don't detect any traps. Mm, I'm going to look up at the ceiling. Is there anything clinging up mm, there? You see nothing on the ceiling, although you can see that it's a pretty secure-looking section. Drilling through probably would have been very difficult. Doable, but difficult. Mm. But yeah, there's a beautiful uh, floor mural and uh, a large number of vaults up against the wall. Stay on guard. I feel like something might come out of those vaults. Or out of somewhere. Yeah. A phantasmal killer! Yeah. All right. Wop. More of... More All right. Those. No, if they get over here. Security bot. I was, I was going to watch the door, but okay. Uh, we'll need all the help we can get in moving this I gold. The, I guess preparing to take the dodging action as we go in, I guess. Uh, before sure. I leave, I'm going to slide the bolt lock to the front door. Put put out a, you yeah, know, out, there out yes, of the lunch there, sign yeah. or something. Uh, they don't have one to hand. Yeah, just write it on a piece of paper. Just like quickly scroll one out. Yeah, just write it on a piece of paper and then slap it out there. Yeah, I'm going to be stealthed. Vera will nod. Yeah. I'll try and discourage anyone from coming. And yeah, I'll I guess it. we'll let the fighter go in first. Dodgy, dodgy. All right, you dodge and enter. Nothing assaults you. I'm going to then look for magical shit, throw an arcana out. Yeah. 
Uh, Probably that cloak. Uh, the cloak is magical, and you also can see what looks like an ice pick that's magical. Hmm. Interesting. Oh. I'll go and pick that one up. Sure. Like a functionally a dagger? Ooh, yeah, it is. It's one of my mastered weapons. Dagger. We can any other block. Okay. When someone attempts to search and make stealth test with advantage, turns magical for penetrating resistance so long as the target is not wearing heavy armor. Ooh. Neat. Nice. Like, it's not a super strong magic weapon. It is pretty mundane, all things considered, but it is a rogue toy. Yeah. And Le Cloak? Funny story about It's Le a cloak. cloaker. Oh god, it's my god, a living it's a cloak, isn't it? <laughs> it is a cloaker. Yay! Uh, cloaker! <laughs> of course oh, it is! No, 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 Dang it, I was hoping for a new fancy uh, red cloak for red. Our initiative? It might yep. as well, yeah. Yeah, because uh, it's still okay. basically in exactly initiative in order. Oh. Yep. Glad okay. I've been dodging. No, you just put that thing on. There's no. Well, you picked it up anyway. What? what? Well, no, so you you just picked it up. It's literally in your hands. You can't be dodging the thing that you're holding. I haven't picked it up. I I don't remember her saying she picked it up. Yeah, but... I never said I picked it up. You, okay, I guess you said let's 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 have a look at this cloak then, and I figured that you fucking pick the goddamn thing up. Whatever, I guess it will make an attack yeah. to you without its advantage, but. Nah. Didn't matter. Attack. Did not matter. All right. Right, Brad. That beautiful cloak Red picked up just came to life angrily. Step forward. Uh, hmm. On guard, good cloak. Oh, no guard. No on. Uh, what's the AC of a cloak? Turn that. Uh, not that low. I had to move so I couldn't study aim, so. Yep. I'm all right. Oop, I'll actually move Zip over. on in here right and here. give it the whack. Do, 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 do. Uh, friends aren't difficult to rain anymore. It did not matter straight. Uh, what? Friends aren't difficult to terrain in 6 You can walk through your friends, no problem. Doesn't cost How about movement. a 14 to hit? Uh, 14 is a Yeah, hit. boy! That's a shitload of damage. Uh, let us... See here, it is. That's unpleasant. Twenty saps. As a reaction, oh, no. uh, what reactions? Yeah, I just fought uh, one of these in Baldur's Gate. It was pretty great. Really? Oh, cool. I, I, I had no idea that had yet. a phantasm ability. I'd forgotten all about that until just I literally today. Madness. I stubbed my toe on a to make this bright light in here. It's a mirror image. While it's dark. Okay, so if somebody lights a torch nearby, it gets I do have the light spell. Or someone could light a torch. Yeah. yeah. Maybe have Ross pull that out since Ross. his damage is if bad. You, if you can light a torch, I will act and surge the fuck out of this thing. Oh. Wait, are we in the dark? Yeah, it's dark in here. It's dim light uh, inside the vault, yeah. Yeah. Uh, well, even like if it has, well if it has in the, dark in the main, in the main. We bank. just need you to light a torch. I, we're to not get rid talking of about dark vision. No. Uh, yeah, it has. Yeah, yeah it has mirror image while it's dark here. Yeah, if it's in bright light, then it loses its mirror image effect. I see. Yeah, I I don't have a torch on me. I don't need them, unfortunately. Oh, that's fine. Oh yeah, that's fair. Yeah, you are you are a dark vision gloom stalker human. I'm yes. the professional sneak around of the dark steelsman, so yeah, I can see why you wouldn't bring a torch around. Yeah. Anyway, I'm just gonna hit it. You can always dispatch its mirror images the old-fashioned way. Uh, yeah. Okay. Oh, you gotta roll though. Was that All right, scary? roll me a d4. Is it a one or a four that uh, hits the real boy? A four hits the okay. real boy. You hit the like real that? boy. Eight. 
I don't All believe right. he can be toppled, unfortunately. He he flappy flap. That's where you're uh, wrong. <laughs> you can absolutely knock a flying creature prone uh, and then it falls. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, you can yeah. just topple him and make him prone. Oh, yeah, yeah. All right. Unless he's immune to he prone. You. If you cannot, in fact, <laughs> topple him. Well, let's try. D4. Oh, you just hit an illusion. And the illusion is toppled and falls over. 16? That would be it, right? Roll me a d3. Three hit. All right, down another image. Oh, I hit it and fucked out too, so that's pretty good. Yeah, honestly. Yeah? Yeah. Nice. All righty, Vera. Uh, Do you want to happen to have dancing lights with you? She's nowhere near here. She's not in there. Uh, oh, indeed, right. uh, you've got two rounds, I think, of Bless left. That's fine. Yep. Should be. That's all we need. Fred! Okay. This uh, well, is first... really trying to get on you. Yeah, first let me step out of like the space of the cloaker. Okay. And then we do the short sword. That hits. Let me guess. Roll a d2. d2. Uh, one d2. There goes oh. the other one. All right. Short sword. 17 to hit. 10 damage. Yep. And crossbow. 10 damage. Fuck Action surge. Out. One, two. It hit 16. Whoa. All right. And. Uh, for good measure, let's go ahead and use a side die, shall we? Uh, if my cloaker doesn't get a single turn. Oh, uh, <laughs> yes! Three health. <laughs> well, I tried. I did, like, 40 you damage nearly, there. nearly stopped me. Alright, Cloaker-chan gets to do a thing. Uh... I surrender! Oh, you can talk. They nods. Eh, fair enough. It flaps there. Don't kill me, thieves. Mm, don't talk to the coppers. Insight? And we'll have a deal. Hmm. I'll fucking... Yeah, he's afraid enough to not try anything stupid. Or persuade on him. <laughs> hey, I can, I yeah, can toss and intimidate. Yeah, yeah, yeah intimidate him. works. Yeah, uh, that was just to check to see if he was fucking scared. So I mean, assuming you don't also roll a one, he's he, yeah, he's spooked. He ain't he ain't, he ain't snitching. Right. I won't knock. All right. And then uh, it flies out of the room and goes to hide inside a cupboard. You know, fair enough. It just hangs himself yeah, up. No, good. Yeah, yeah, it hangs himself up. <laughs> yeah, clearly right. someone just hung him up in the wrong place. I didn't think those were real. Hmm. All right, money time. No, neither do I. All right, money time. Let's go. Trying to get paid. All right. Uh, athletics test, everyone, please. It's time to smash and grab. The bag job needs the bag part. Athletics. Yeah, yeah. All okay. right. Athletics uh, check. On the Hell floors yeah. is 10,000 gold worth All right. of treasure. Since I... However, there is oh, another... T there's another 10,000 inside, like, spread out amongst these many stone vaults set in the wall here. You do not see a discernible way to open any of these vaults up, however. Uh, can I make, like, Let's an arcana test to try and figure out the opening mechanism? Sure. sure. I'll I have a sledgehammer. That'll work if necessary. Uh, 22. Yeah, uh, there's probably some kind of runestone that's pressed up against them. Alright. Uh, you did not see one on the bard when you tossed his pockets. He had a key for his drawers, but clearly doesn't have the safety deposit runes on oh, him. I will go search his body real quick. Oh. Nah, you find no runes. Uh, not his body, sorry. Uh, the, his desk. Here. Uh, okay. Also. Well. I think that's something that the... Uh, the 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 head banker has in his own yeah. safety, in his own safe. Mm. 
Anyways, you said athletics. Yep. Scoop. All right. Since I have a mage hand oh. ledger domain, and uh, you know that's sort of the arcane treasures whole thing, could I roll Arcana to just use mage hands to just scoop shitloads of money into the cart instead of athletics? Could someone yeah, guidance right. me? Uh, sure. So I can get above. I don't think you right. can guidance while you're concentrating on mage uh, hands. Uh, funny uh, story. Yeah. I don't think mage hand is actually concentration. Uh... No, it's not. I'm going to use inspiration okay. on that nine. Okay. Could you guidance yes. me then so I can try to get above a 15? To a 15. There yes. we go. 15. Thank you. 15. I am at a. All right. Yeah. You all beat the AC, the DC correctly asserted as 15. Oh, no. I was just trying to get, you know, and uh, multiple clues of. Five. Yeah, which is how DCs yeah. and 5e work. All right. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, that, yeah, that is how DCs. Yeah, probably. you beat 15, which is the standard DC. I I use like 12s and 14s pretty regularly, depending on level. But yeah, 15 yeah. is the standard in a lot of situations. I was about to say, like, I've, we've had plenty of like yeah. DC 13 and stuff like that, DC 12s. Yeah. yeah. Anyway. Uh, but yeah, all right. You are able to successfully scoop up 10,000 gold worth of fucking Luca, baby, Luca. However. You are going to need to sledge open some vaults if you want to crack those open. There's 10,000 more gold you're potentially leaving alone otherwise. That said, it's a loud job and probably pretty tiny. Do you have any more second level spells, Ross? Uh, yeah, I have. Uh, no, I'm out. Okay. I, I used uh, silence now, twice. He I'm can use level. silence as a ritual. That just takes right? 10 whole minutes. Right. It does take 10 whole minutes, mm -hmm. though, and that would be eating and into seconds. your... And six seconds. True. Yeah, you're right. Yes, 10 and 6 seconds. That would be eating into your escape time. Yeah, we you might You are now try. probably at, like, an hour and a half until sunset. I also yeah. have, like, eight more minutes of rage. I can smash, like... I was about to say, we can just... As I can. We can just try the smash and grab. Hold on. Alrighty. I have an idea real quick. Yeah. This guy had, like, ticket stubs that he kept for what goes in the lockboxes, right? Could I do a yes. quick investigation check to try and figure out which lockboxes have the most valuable shit in them so we can prioritize Ooh, them? Hey, yeah, can I, yes. I do that is, on that? in fact, a ledger do book. You could just double-check these numbers and cross-reference. Right, do you need a test for that? Yeah, I'll assist you you will note, however, yes, I will need a test because they are written in code. If you have cartography or forges, then you have advantage on this uh, test. Well, she has a banjo anyway, I'm helping. So it'll oh, okay. just be intelligence then? Uh, okay, investigate. that's fine then. Uh, 19. All right, 19. Nice. Uh, yes, okay. You are pretty sure you can narrow down a whole 2,000 to one of uh, to a single vault door. Okay, yeah, let's get that for, pretty good. for certain and then kind of try and go in descending order and work your way down all right then so let's see here uh so it is eight to the side walls uh eight to the side walls okay so at an average you're looking at like 260 gold per vault door remaining uh Roll me a d20. We'll see if you can get most of it in 10 boxes or less. Right. Do you want higher or low? Guardy beat us? It doesn't matter. It's right in the middle. Doesn't matter. All right, so it would be right in the middle. Okay, so yeah, on checking through this ledger, about half of the boxes actually make up the majority of them. Okay. Let's try and just grab like a quarter and then see where we are with time. Okay. All right then. Uh, roll me. Throw big guidance on Fergus and his sledgehammer. All right. Roll me ten d three hundred. Oh, okay. Sure. Fifteen ninety two. All right. That's so in a, those are excellent rolls. In a it's quarter crazy. of the boxes, you managed to pull out fifteen ninety two. Nice. All right. So, is that in addition to the two thousand? So, uh, yeah, and then you also get. Uh, yeah, I'm pretty satisfied with that. I think we should just hightail it while we have the chance. Let's yeah, it. that makes that and makes like what thirteen thousand initial ten thousand. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. So, so we're like rolling 13, about thirteen, thirteen fifty. Yeah. All right. I mean, so, I'm very satisfied with that. With that I, yeah, that's giant. that's plenty. Let's. I think our patron will be too. Okay. Let's 
Yeah, uh, all right, give me an athletics, uh, please. We'll just see how long that took you, Fergal. You should have advantage, because you're reaching. Yep, and yep. a guidance Angie. die, too. Uh, add a d4. Does guidance go on skills? Yeah, that's the whole yes. point of it. Yes. Oh, guidance does, yes. Sorry, I was... You're I, thinking was thinking bless. Bless. I got confused oh, with bless. Or something. Seeing which blesses. Oh, yeah, no. Bless wore off after two rounds. Which bless would have worn off anyway. Well, I'm glad he I'm had advantage. Oh, do you have an inspiration, inspiration. for rolling that? Uh, yep. Yeah. Whoa, there we go. There you go. Oh, or it could be a prayer. All right, you get that done in like fucking 10 minutes flat. And you do it with a surprising amount of silence. Like... You just nail each of them on the corner. You find some really good spots. If the impact is louder than the crash, like I it's believe. a good just thump against the wall and it crumples. I believe the word was adroit. The word is adroitly done. Yep. <laughs> Very adroit. Uh, and you know what? With a crit, you get a bonus. One of oh, these vaults the happens to have shiny things in it. Shiny things. We love shiny things. That's right. We love shiny things. Are they jewels? Are they, loot. are they jewel nipple piercings? Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, no, no, right. You find. Oh, great. Sorry, save it. Ooh. 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 Pretty princess dress up shit. Yay. Collectible. Yep. Okay, I gotta kick that one. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you can have the silk. Whoa, okay. There you go. The whole oh. golden princess makeup cap. What is a princess makeup kit without bejeweled nipple piercings? You disappoint me, whoever this uh, you've is. You've only got four. If you've gotten six, then you've gotten the bejeweled nipple piercings. Yeah. <laughs> we had the whole... Well, I'll just have to get them myself. My wife is going to love this shit. You can do that classic, like, leaving lipstick rings all the way down the deck. It's a good look. All right, yes. Enjoy all yourselves. All right. This card is a fucking heavy one. And you're able to wheel it out. Yep. Vera looks like she's... Well, I mean, she is a criminal. She's not exactly dying of nerves here, but she looks at impatient more than terrified. You've done an excellent job by the look of that burgeoning cart weight. Yes, we've got about as much as Juniper can possibly mm -hmm. carry. Yeah, excellent. Also very tame horse. Yes, yeah, she's a good girl. I would not think her a getaway beast. And then she smells crime on you and just sort of like prances up, just gets all antsy. I take it back. She's very good at her job, aren't you, girl? Very well. I will, uh... Let's see here. I suspect your current safe house is no good if they've been particularly close. I'm going to have to find a new one and possibly be in it myself. Yeah, mm -hmm. um... Well, we do have to go you meet with Alban, tell her that we've been successful. Yes, let's get that out of the Indeed. way. Indeed. Uh, tell you what, I will meet all of you at the Ember Rat tonight, and I'll have another safe house. Which it would seem that I'm also moving into temporarily. Very well. Nine. Happy to have you. <sighs> she sighs. It is a real fuck up, and I apologize for all of this. If you wish to be done with the job afterwards, I will... Figure out the last plaque myself. Mm. Ah. We'll see about it after this. If you want to succeed, you have to take risks. No, I'm not. True, there's risks, and then there's getting caught out by the masons. I'm not going to leave you high and dry. Now, come on. Well, I appreciate that. And yeah, she will walk off in a totally different direction and presumably go do that classic rogue thing of shake tails, etc. Uh, she's definitely not going to trust a single bush for the rest of her fucking life. <laughs> yeah, she's in the goddamn trees. 
You are all able to return to the meetup. Let me just uh, slide these boys back into the old GM layer. Well, you know you're there, motherfuckers. Yeah, I mean, you know they're there. Let's see. Vera. Uh, give you. the bushes an up nod. I'll wait for her to give me like a signal to actually keep moving forward. Because I'm pretty sure guards are going to get a little antsy if it just went up too quickly. Yeah. Fergus Ross, stay with the car. She... Just going to sit myself in uh, one of the benches, unhook uh, my rapier, and just uh, lean it against the side. Yeah, look at you, positively bloodless, I see. Yes. That's right. Unlike uh, some associates uh. who are actually fairly decent at our jobs. Oh, well, don't hold it against the child too long. The money was a setup in the first place. <laughs> Good to know. Fun. Tell you what, I'll give you a thousand gold here and now if you tell me what the black is for. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry, that's uh, client confidentiality. I'm sure you understand. Hmm. Then instead, I have another question. Does your little discovery put this town in danger? And I will know if you're lying. Discovery? No, it does not. Not that I've ever been told. Were we meant to make a discovery? Northy just spreads his hands. She stares levelly. Very well. But you go and let your hometown friendly families know if whatever these plaques are related to is actually a danger. Things are getting darker in the outside world, even though it's impossible to tell behind old Hollish's lovely walls. Yes, I'm acutely aware. Oh, are you? That almost sounds like a story, do dash. <laughs> I'd rather not, but... Suffice to say, if you're concerned about the dark, it's already reached your doorstep. Oh, I know that much. It's where they want to, uh, you know, announce they own my little house. They don't. And the dark doesn't well, that's own. a relief. It consumes. Ugh. You're just desperate for the last word, aren't you, dear? Dear? Northy will laugh. Amy will just on, click man, her I'll jaw closed and smile. Just pick it. Yeah, just uh, sweep myself back onto my feet, grab my rapier, hook it back on. Oh, she gets that one of those fancy long lady smoking the pipes. Plaque, please. Uh, well, it has been a pleasure doing business with you. Oh, I'm sure you walk away with this with a pretty little penny. Just uh, don't let the other families find out. If you talk about not. me, I'll deny it and have you all hung and tortured. Of course well, not. Should you hung. ever wish? Both. Hung and I don't know who you are, and I don't think I've ever but... seen you. Now the plaque, please. Excellent. So he will give from... the Emmett Silk wave as he walks away. Come in my way, Ross. Yeah. Uh, a little mage yep. hand dips oh, wait, into the fountain. Uh, dips into the fountain and pulls out the plaque. Still dripping. It just sort of floats its way over to you. Of course. Should you wish for more business, I'm sure you have ways of contacting me. Mm, oh, possibly. I'd have to actually check. With that, I bid you adieu. Mm-hmm. She returns Rattle to put, reading her book. Well, put a little extra wiggle in her butt as she walks away. Uh, let's see here. I don't think there's any way for you to catch her, Myron. If she's Meyer and she's doing a real stealthy. <laughs> I mean, it's worth it trying to perception it. Yeah. Probably yeah. not going to happen. <laughs> no, I don't catch it. Yeah, Lady, Lady Alba Mason here is like a 10th level arcane trickster. <laughs> That's fine. You're going to wait. Uh, you're just going to wake up with her in your bed and she's just going to go, uh, you have already come. <laughs> Listen, that's fine. That's a perfect trickster power. <laughs> Listen, yeah. that's a perfectly fine outcome in what I'm going for here. <laughs> Reasonable. 
All right. And yeah, you're able to flitter out unmolested. Now, it is as you are leaving the park and climbing into your haunts that you begin to hear yeah, noises down the street. It looks like your bank job has been uh, rumbelloed. Honestly, things were like really quiet for a while, and no one's looking in your particular direction right now, but that might be about to change. Thankfully, a hot pie man appears to have moved on. Also, you should get a hot pie. They're delicious. I should get a hot I pie. A hot it's pie. been it's Maybe been a later. while since it's been a while since I got the uh, hot dog with uh, that's mostly not rat. It's time for a hot pie that is might have rat in it, but that's fine. It's it's a it's a bank in the temple district, and it's on the corner of that. It might actually be re like cow. My God, <laughs> it might actually be real rat. <laughs> you know, you know that fake rat for the fancy fuckers <laughs> up the street. Alright. All right. So, how much do does our things increase? We still Let's gotta see here. We still so, gotta get away first. Maybe. Yeah, we've got uh, escapes to make. Uh, right now, your heat rating is only 3. You rep 3, guard 3. Your reputation will not come into account for this. The guard presence is a multiplier. Your heat is a multiplier. So it is 9 tests, averaging d20s. Let's see what you gotta beat. Oh no. Oh, there's what a crit in there. Alright, there's at that? least one person you're gonna have to get away run from, but let's see if there are more of them. Uh how do you use to try and there. ditch him? Uh that guy? What kind of guy is it? No no, uh, to, to ditch the group in general, like you set the DC for all of them, essentially. Like you could get real low and then like the seventeens and fifteens can also be on your on your tail. Oh. Uh are we going to use pa uh, Pass Without a Trace, or...? Yeah, I would say sneaking, I don't think we'll like, like disguising it. the uh, cart up to look just like a merchant wagon and clopping away. Yeah, some Someone help me with deception. I've got, I've got a 10 stealth. Can I, can I do that with a disguise kit? Um, you can burn disguise the entire kit. disguise kit for I, it. I mean, it's to you, that's probably chump change to replace it. But yeah, you yeah, use up the yeah. full contents of the disguise, like paint up the side of the wagon, etc. Oh yeah, that's you need disguise kit and they still rest. Considering we're like... Oh no, really does anyone have inspo? Nope. Uh, I feel like you have advantage, use... Grad and Fran. Yeah, Gaudi yeah, is a 23. We... So you're well disguised, but you're being pretty overt with it. So you're going to have to do some quick talk. All right. Who wants to give me a deception? No, I don't have an inspiration Northy. for it. Who can help Northy? Uh, Amy can. She's trained in deception, too. Cool. All yeah, right. I can help out. So yeah, a bunch of guards are going to flag you guys down. It looks like one, two, three, four of them are going to flag you down. Give me a deception. 22. Let's see here, there's another crit in there. One of them ain't buying it. God uh, damn. can we try and bribe this guy? You absolutely can. Would you like to give me a persuasion or an intimidation with advantage? How much money are you going to put in? Uh, if we go too much, it'll be suspicious. Let's try and drop, like, 20 gold. I think that's, uh, that's, what, a, like that's a pretty gold, good amount for a guard, right? It's a huge amount for a guard, yeah. 20 gold. I think 10 gold is probably good. Cut in the middle, go 15. Okay, 15 gold. Alright, persuasion or intimidation? Who has the highest persuasion? Or Oh no, I just did something I, I can't help. No, yeah, you just, uh, you just did your fast talk. I have 5 in persuasion. I do too. I guess I'll just continue assisting with the talking. Okay. Sure. Okay. 19? Alright, a 19. Alright, I mean... All right, he's a greedy son of a bitch. He takes the money. All right. Whew. Well done. Okay, so it is a close one. You do not start a for real horse chase through the city. That would have been real bad for us with a cart laden oh, this heavy. No. Yeah, I was going to yeah, say, your cart, your cart is so heavy that I probably would have had to take you to an encounter map to fight. I was about to say, if it turned into something like that, Northy would have just uh, once again yelled on guard and jumped on the guy. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. He's lucky that he was greedy, frankly. Okay. 
Well then, you have gotten away from the guards in general pursuit right now, but you were seen by a bunch of people, and at least one person is now made richer by your hand. That'll trickle down at least to some degree. Uh, how do you get away to your current safe house? I think it's just stealthing away, like uh, taking Why? back alleyways and the like, right? Okay. I'm just going to meld yes, into so. the uh, the crowds, the CD bars, and the gambling halls where, uh, you know, take off my disguise, you know, find a place. Oh, no, take you off still got to get the actual cart to your safe house because it's got 14,000 yeah. gold on it. Uh, yeah. yeah, so we need to take, like, back alleyways and stuff like that. Yeah. And, I think, right? Sure, yeah, you can give me another stealth Sounds test. Sounds good to yeah. me. There we go. 26? 26. 26. Okay, you are able to do so. You probably get halfway and then strip off the disguise and put on a new one. You know, the typical business. Uh, change the colour on the tarp or something. Yeah. Take At this rate, the... though, as you return, your reputation has gone up by one uh, because you did it non-lethally for all intents and purposes. Nice. Your heat yeah. has gone up by two. Yeah, that's unfortunate. They didn't. The guard presence. Crits there. The, bank, the bank got robbed. The guard presence is up by three. Yeah. Is there now a curfew of the guard presence? Uh, let's see here. No, because your violent crime hasn't involved any innocent deaths. That's that was the threshold for the curfew. Uh, you have oh, avoided that. Potentially. Yeah, you're just criminals. You are not violent, dangerous murderers. Which is where people start curfewing and attacking on site at night. That's good. And there's a difference between people coming over to arrest you or people coming over to you with their weapons out. Yeah. Alright, congratulations. You have gotten the money away. We have plenty of cash waiting for you. Alright. Hooray. So let's see here. This nice. is, uh... 14, 287, and it's split, what, five ways? Yep. Yeah, so right uh, now okay. we have 14, 287, split five ways. Yeah, that's... 2,857 Whoa. gold pieces each. Plus you made your 200 gold <laughs> each from the job. Yeah. That's still paid yeah. out. So 3,000 overall each? Yeah, you just made 3,000 gold in a day. Crime are does we... pay. It pays really fucking hard, you guys. Are we going to be yeah. splitting this up <laughs> yeah. now? Or next We're splitting session? it now. Yeah. Let me get to figure out what the fuck we do with this money. Yeah, you can... Now, I suppose I should, should say it. You are in Holisher, one of the few places in the Chivalric you can just fucking buy a magic item uh, because it's all illegally re re uh, acquired. You'll have to pass tests in order to locate the right people to make the purchase without it turning into a fucking fight, you know, that kind of thing. Like, all right, yeah. I'll keep the weapon and the money. Like, you know, that typical fucking mm -hmm. maneuver happens plenty of times, I'm sure. So the markup on these, it's only a 10% markup from what it should be in the book, but that is because it comes with all of these skills. What the skill fuck tests. is in the book? So look up things that- There's no prices for magic items in the book. the book. The fucking- the magic <laughs> And they're all made up like by a, you. Not, not the actual book. Yeah, they're all they're all made up by me. Um, but yeah, markups exist. The fucking value and everything. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You you can see the the common, uncommon, rare, very rare. Yeah. Yada yada yada. Find what you want. I'll tell you what it should cost. It'll be more expensive than usual, but not by as much. But that's because I'll be giving each of you individual skill tests to acquire anything magical that you want. Or you can I buy know. a shitload of mundane okay. stuff. You know. I know okay. exactly what I want because it's got a wolf's head hilt. I want the frost brand rapier. Cool I guess I have to look up magic items then. <laughs> yeah, you'll have a, have a goosey gander. I know. Yeah, it it, it fits into Northy's whole theme. <laughs> I mean, here. If I might recommend. Look. look. And I'm just going to buy pots, but look. This one a good page. A, a greatest healing potion. <laughs> All right. So, is that what we're calling it for the night? I believe so. With big fat yeah. money in your pockets, and nice. I'm going Sounds to. Good. All right, I'm going to change my name, and I'm going to tell you guys how to pronounce it. <laughs> Excellent. Okay, let's see here. 
Let me see your name change and then I'm try to pronounce before you tell me how to pronounce it. Jonathan Danger Law PI. You said it wrong. Of course. Danger Law. Yeah, no. Danger Law. Jonathan oh, okay. Danger Law. Private That's... Eye. That okay. is true, yeah. You didn't say it right before. Jonathan Danger Law. Private Eye is how it's there pronounced. There you go. You have to remind me, my accent slips occasionally. Okay, so you're supposed to Damn pronounce it, it like like uh, uh Zap Brannigan. Like Zap Brannigan. Yeah, yeah, you gotta really, really fuel some Brannigan. Alright, your token is updated for next week as well. I hope you guys enjoyed. I yeah, did congratulations yeah. on payday, Ian. Yeah, that was a lot of fun. Yeah, yeah it was great. Ugh. All right, and if you're watching on the stream YouTube, thanks for Look tuning you guys. in. I didn't have to filter in God. We'll see God. you next time. Hell yeah.